jewelrymaker.com and we'll do the rest. If your ideas are selected, we'll send the made-up jewellery to you. Hello, a very good morning to you and welcome to Jewellery Maker. My name is Fee and uh, well, it's, I only said it's for for friday <laughs> It's uh, the weekend, it's Saturday. Um, yes, and if you joined us yesterday with uh, the lovely Vicky and Cherry, and uh, you, you'll have seen that we've started our one PMP all weekend. So uh, today, Saturday, of course, I'm with you today and tomorrow with the Sunday Sofa guests. So we, we've got lots to enjoy together. I've got some beautiful high-end aquamarine. I've got a fee mystery, mystery strand as such. And uh, we're going to set up a competition in a moment uh, with that for the texting um, and a subject today. But I'm not on my own. I'm here with the delectable Lucy. So let's say hello to Lucy. Good morning. Hey, morning. It's, been, it's been an age, my it darling. It has been, hasn't it? It has. <laughs> uh, we're going to set Lucy a challenge today and she's got three brand new kits one of which is being modeled by my beautiful assistant Gemma today uh, I love the name Gemma uh, and now I still haven't worked, quite worked out what it stands for but I believe it stands for something to do with jewelry is easy making something or other but I was I miss what the pseudonym means what, what it actually stands for the acronym I should say so uh, this actually have another look at our friend Gemma do you think we look good together we're in the black and the white it wasn't by chance it was actually deliberate I love a snooker player and she looks glamorous, but just look, this is, this is the important thing. This is from our first new kit. It's actually our high-end kit. We've got three kits today under £25, okay? And this is the high-end kit. So this is the one we're actually going to start with. And that incredible, beautiful, rutilated quartz with the onyx there. Yeah, so this is one of the beautiful pieces of jewellery. If you're new to us today, what we do here is make jewellery with real gemstones. So Gemma's modelling one of the pieces and we'll actually be able to show you how to make that with our first kit of the day, which actually is the highest, the high-end kit. So when I've said all three are going to be under £25, okay, you're going to be spending no more than that. And this is one of the glorious pieces that you can make. The other piece I'm wearing, let me just drape this over Gemma. Oh, did you come here often, girl? Uh, there you go. There's that beautiful bracelet and you can make a beautiful pair of earrings as well out of the kit. So uh, just a few of the examples of the pieces of jewellery that you can make. So, lots of exciting kits. I've got another beautiful kit as well. Um, that's sort of, would you describe it as golds? So I know there's a bit of Botswana in there, so I'm sold already. Um, Botswana! That's the second kit of the day. And uh, my mystery, my mystery strand. Now, I want you to text me in. First person to guess what is in my mystery strand or strands. Could be either or. Text me in, I'm gonna send you it for free. First person to guess it right, six zero treble seven. And for those of you that don't guess it, I will say I have a mystery price. It is a price for the, the thing uh, that you will never have seen before, okay? We've taken money off. It's an amazing offer, so nobody feels like they miss out. But if you can guess Fee's mystery strand pack, or is it strands, is it a pack of strands? And you know what, quite frankly, if it was more than one strand and you just guessed one of them, uh, that could be the winning answer. What we do need is your customer number when you text in. Here's the text number, 60777, start your message, JM Studio. And our subject today is, what have you made from watching one of our DVDs? You know our DVDs that we do? Well, I don't show what it is. They've got to guess what it is. Oh, no, no, Karen, no, no. If I show it, they'll know straight away. No, you've got to be doing this blind. You've got to be doing this blind. Now, I am coming back. Ha ha. Uh, one of our DVDs, because while you're, while you're texting in, let's, let's have a bit of a, a convo here. Uh, what have you watched in terms of one of our DVDs and what have you made? You know, you could be a new buyer who got our free new v DVD. What have you made from watching or, or one of our bought DVDs? Four ninety five each with loads of different ones to do with, in this case, beading basics, wire work, um, you've got uh, macrame, you've got the gizmo work. I mean, there's loads on our website. So let me know, what have you, what have you made out of our... So text in, oh, let me know.
Both myself and Lucy would love to hear from you. There's uh, the text messenger service. Start your message, JM Studio, and you can find it on the website, our DVDs, if you're interested in looking at more of those, under Tools. Because I suppose they're a, a, a learning tool, aren't they? So there you have it on our website, www.jewellerymaker.com. And I'd like to know today, what have you made from watching one of our DVDs? And then at the end of it, try and guess, at the end of your text, try and guess what's in my mystery pack. And if you guess right, first person to guess right, Brenda, I'm sorry, my sweet, you're wrong. If I'm sorry, uh, if you guess right, I'll send you it for free. What do you reckon, Luce? That's, it's worth a text, isn't it? Exactly. A few no, it'll be the first probably. person to get it right, because if I have 100 people, I might not have the stock, might I? No, so it'll be the first person to get it right, OK? And I'll keep you updated if, if, they, if you get it, if you don't. Also, new in! Yes, new in! Oh, heavens above. Have you got this on the lazy, my darling? I've got the most amazing... Now, myself and uh, Karen, my beautiful producer, we've actually taken money off this brand-new bundle, this brand-new three-strand pack, and it is my turquoise and amazonite you were taking almost eight pounds off what you should be paying on this, okay? It is that beautiful natural Amazonite, that fantastic turquoise, which is so good with chocolate browns. Um, and this is our brand new three strand pack. Now, this is gonna be Midday Madness. Midday Magic, 12 o'clock. There's no birds, they've flown the nest loose. The big bird and the baby bird. I don't know where they've gone, uh, but I've got a challenge for you, beautiful. So what would you like me to do, honey bun? Oh, a late show reduction review. That's not easy. And then my twisted diamond. Oh, these are gorgeous. Look at these. Actually, let me show you these with my hyper scheme because this is new today coming up. But I just want to show you how fantastic they look. And the reason I picked those up is because the pillow shape. Now, these are my twisted uh, jaspers, zebra jaspers. But look at that with the hyper scheme. Oh, that's later. That's later. Keep you in suspenders for a little bit longer. And if you're new to Jewellery Maker, I'll be telling you how to get involved in a moment. So stay with me. But we're all about real gemstones. It's about making jewellery. And actually, Gemma, wouldn't that look lovely in that first kit, Luce? Were you? Seriously, great minds. <laughs> wouldn't worked, that well. look fantastic in that first new kit? Or with Gemma's that outfit. Oh, yeah. Actually, it wouldn't half look gorgeous as well with our third new kit of the day so and with our kit new jewelry makers and this is what I'll explain it's a great way to start you know because you've got everything you need but for the regulars we also show the individual strands to put with the kits to make your kits go even further so we'll explain more in a moment but you can still get strands and start your jewelry making with us because we don't just deal in the kits we deal in the findings the individual strands the different beading materials now i've got an absolute brilliant price on it. well we know it's an absolute brilliant price but you may not have seen it on the evening show it's already been price slashed on the evening show that crazy crazy evening show the original price just to put you in the picture and to get you phoning was originally 7.95 originally 7.95 and if you're happy with that, for this beautiful zebra jasper with all those very distinctive, it's like you got the brush and you just paint splashed. I look like I'm fishing, don't I? 235 carats of jasper twisted diamond shapes. And you can just see if I lay those out, just how different they are. They're beautiful, aren't they? Some are just completely black. Some are the, the very different sort of stripes. They almost look like the ink, blotted ink, don't they? When you've added water to ink on the page. Now we're not, oh, let's mix it up a bit. We're not staying at 7.95. That was the original price. No, we're not. That was a price slash on the evening show. You might have missed it. So let's review it, 5.95. And it looks fantastic with that first kit. And in a kit, New Jewelry Makers, we put everything you need to get started. So we can start, we can open our order today. If you bought yesterday with Vicky and Cherry, you're adding to your order. You're not paying another 4.95 postage and packaging price. So, you know, 5.95, that's all it is. You or, or you can start your order today. We're with each other for the next, you know, 40, well, I'm not here for 24 hours, but I'm with you tomorrow and we've got two more evening shows to take advantage of and the bargains. So, we've got lots we can add to our order with. And we can start our order on the website. Make sure you've got your login established with this incredible strand. 235. And I love the shape. Isn't the shape great, Luce? It is. 
It's just different. It's so unusual, you don't get it very often. It is, isn't it, it? It's nice just to give that extra dimension with a different shape. Exactly. And it's not a dynamic shape. We, we see a lot, isn't no, it? The diamonds, not. but the twisty the diamonds. Twisted, yeah. And they're, they're really nice just to hold as they well. They are. They've got, you're really tactile, aren't yeah. they? You want to touch them. and Because you kind of just want to, ooh, I can feel the twistiness. Feel it's such a thing. Feel the, Feel the twistiness. <laughs> oh, I like that. And they just sit beautifully. And because those because those patterns on there are so dynamic, it's lovely to have that twisty. Because then if they do sort of swivel over, you can see front and back how dynamic the beauty really is. And it is absolutely get corker with the first new kit today. So five ninety five, the twisted diamonds, two hundred thirty five carats. And I will say, when they price slashed out in the evening show, they went like hotcakes. So the remaining availability, do jump on it. I don't want you to miss out, and because I promise you, the first new kit is beautiful. And you know, this again, it just goes so beautifully with the rutilated quartz. If I just do this, let's take one of the earrings out of the first new kit. Yeah, can you see how those stripes, those patterns? Yeah. Well, I'm wearing the bracelet, aren't I? Look. Yeah, that's a cheeky bracelet from another kit that are there as well. But there, you see. It's, it's just perfect and they're different because the quartz has that clarity in a way but there you've got the more opaqueness the patterns it's like a Jackson Pollock isn't it it's like the ink on the water beautiful there we have it so 5.95 I believe a bird's just flown in can I just say don't bother going out have you noticed how I said this last night you get up in the morning it's raining you go out and you do your chores it's raining you go and collect the kids or, or whatever from nursery or school, it's raining. You come home, you're trying to go in and out, you sort out the cats, it's raining. Seven o'clock at night, it stops. It's lovely. That's the best part of the day, isn't it? When you're absolutely <laughs> jiggers, you're sitting down and you need a, a big glass, of, a vat of wine. And uh, you're trying to have your tea or whatever or put the kids to bed. And then you get up in the morning and it's raining. Do you know what? And it just waits, doesn't it? Seven in the evening. It's been every day this week. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. It's been like that, hasn't it, Luce? It has, and I think it's going to continue. I mean, it's really living up to its name, April showers. I can't wait for it. When is it? First of May. Is it Wednesday or Tuesday? Tuesday. Thanks for that, Karen. <laughs> Ray of sunshine in there. It's going to be the coldest May. Somebody said to me yesterday, ooh, we're expecting snow in May. People love doom and gloom sometimes, don't they? But actually, no, to be honest, it's not you. It's the weathermen that are telling us these things. 5 95 Let's cheer ourselves up with some uh, early bird magic. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm going to... Oh, what are you wiggling at me there, Jackie boy? Look at these. How about a bit of warmth and copper and red? And caramel gold. Actually, my, my my Lucy today with the challenge. This would look beautiful with her challenge. Just look at this monster. Oh, look at that. Put a bit of that with this. Ooh. Oh, I don't know. I think we should give the early bird to Lucy as well. Hey, let's take that. That's coming up in the challenge. But anyway, let's get back to what I'm supposed to be doing. Now, new jewelry makers. I'm coming to you. Um, Anything you purchase as a first time buyer, we want to encourage you further. So whether you buy a three strand pack like this and on our website that we just showed you there, we have findings and threading materials. You can get a kit today with all the extra components in it that you need to start making jewelry. Or you can start with three beautiful strands like this that you love. We'll give you a free DVD and Lucy's going to show us techniques. We have techniques on our website. Every day in the morning show, we have live techniques, but these are the ones to get you started. We'll give you that DVD free and our booklet if you're, you're a visual person rather than the auditory and the, you know you just like to read about it this takes you through step by step we'll also give you this month's hub and actually we're celebrating some uh, polymer clay jubilee work there and that's the theme of today's chosen by you so this is our monthly magazine behind the scenes and on the back it explains all the different courses you can do with us loads of different courses you can visit jewelry maker here and take part in a polymer clay course, a beading course, a wire work course. There's loads. So um, that's absolutely free with your first ever order. And you can start by buying strands or a kit. I personally, and I don't know if Lucy's the same, but I personally would recommend a kit simply because it's got everything you need in it. Oh, definitely. Yeah. And then once you've got a kit, you can always add to it. So. Exactly. So if you're thinking, well, actually, I'll wait to see the kit's fee, but I'm going to write down this code because I love, love, love these pearls. And actually, just to highlight to you, if you're new to us, Early Bird is an absolute steal. OK, absolute steal. Now, the original price you're going to see here is fantastic for three genuine gemstone strands. If I just had one of these pearl strands for this price, 
it would be brilliant at 12.95. But it's an early bird special because my regulars already know this is an introductory offer and the aim of it is, you know, I'm not hiding anything from you, the aim of it is to simply start your order with us. But if you started yesterday, you're just adding to one PMP. We're making that lovely DPD man work for his money, aren't we? I work hard for my money. 12.95 is not where we're stopping. I love this shell as well, this little grid, like bronze shell. And then genuine pearls. I got asked this the other day. Yes, they are genuine pearls. They're just covered with that metallic coating. That's like a, a beautiful honey blonde. And this is like a, a beautiful copper bronze. Big potato pearls, eight by nine millimeters on the copper bronze pearls. They're given that metallic coating, but you've got the genuine pearls there. And then that lovely shell, gorgeous. That's two centimeters across. We're not stopping at 12.95 for three strands. This is my early bird, so I need you on the phone lines early. The number at the bottom of the screen, new buyers, is a free phone number. So when you ring 0800 644 655, you're getting through to a free phone number and our customer service center. And you know, you have that one-on-one -on -one experience where you can track your order, have your mobile ready, have your card, have your pen. You can log in on our website. Three! Three! I said three! Seven ninety-five! Heavens above! Tommy, Tom, Tom! Seven ninety-five! Come on now. Have you got your cup of coffee? Have you woken up? Are you having a nice big muffin with jam? What did you have this morning, Luce? No! <laughs> I've got a banana. Would you like a banana? No, right now. Maybe sure. later. I've got some I'm grapes. Okay. I'm okay. I don't like I think you'll pass out on me though. There's a studio like you need something, girl. It's all right, I'll have you something have in the break. <laughs> Goodness me, if we, I think if she starts eating a cereal, we'll forgive her because you need something to get, get you going. 7 95 Hey, this has got me going. This is fantastic. Under eight pounds. We need to put down the croissants. Or if Bruce was here, his cream cheese bagel or salmon croissants or whatever he has, the Duke. Or second kit. Oh my heavens. Absolutely beautiful. Lucy, would you do me a favour and grab something from that second kit? And I and I just flash it in with these just to show everybody the colours. Yeah, I don't mind, my <laughs> darling. Let me just show you. Look at this. This with the with the second kit. Oh, there is some mystic in there. How beautiful would this look with the second kit today? Here's a piece made from it, you see. Isn't that delectable? That would have worked so well. I mean, Lucy's remit is only to work, thank you, my darling, only to work with what's in the kit. But, you know, you can add, and three strands. When you watch the show with me, I mean, a great price point for one strand is $7.95, let alone three genuine pearls. So as a starter like yourself, if you're new to us and you're thinking, right, I'm going to open up my order and I'm going to watch. And if you combine this with a kit, and we already know all three kits, I mean, Gemma's got one on, all three kits are going under 25 pounds. And we tend to have different price points for all three. So I'm trying to drop some big fat hints here. And at 7.95 for three more strands, I mean, Lucy will say as well, you know, you, make a minimum of, you can make a minimum of five pieces from each kit, guaranteed. But with another three strands, that's going to be 10, isn't it? Easily. Easily. And some of them make a lot more as well. And some, of <laughs> course, I've known people like seven or eight just with three strands, let alone, because our kits tend to have three strands in them. But 7 95 And pearls, I mean, these are gorgeous. I just like making stretches and wrapping them with me. Are we awake? Hold on a minute, hold on a minute. Are we up? Good morning. Hello, put down the cornflakes. Uh, make sure you're getting these. Mmm, they're calling to you. They want you. Mmm, I'm beautiful. Ooh, you gotta have me. I'm 7.95. We gotta make sure we're there. We gotta make sure we're awake. We gotta make sure we're dialing and that we don't miss out because it's too much of a bargain. It's my early bird and once the bird's flown, that's it. Once the bird's gone, no more birds. 7.95 for all three. Beautiful. And I think it does go gorgeously with um, the challenge. In fact, let me just put it with this, this Wonderstone Jesper Plain Rounds because um, I just, I don't know what Lucy thinks, we'll ask now, but 
Do you think that goes, Lucy, or am I barking up the wrong tree here? Oh, no, definitely. Yeah. It oh, does, so rich it? and lux luxurious, isn't it? Oh, yeah. I mean, I might take away the shell and just, I'm just loving that. Gorgeous. This, I've never and seen this before. with the pyrite before. as well. You want my darling? With the pyrite as well. I know, I've got <laughs> pyrite coming up as well. Yeah, she's ahead of me there. Um, this is amazing. This is absolutely brand new. And it's 850 carats. It's a wonder, hence the wonder stone. 18 millimetres. And just look at these co colours. That's a really milky chocolate, isn't it? And then a sort of a... I don't know, it's like, it's like a, an orangey colour, but not like a bright orange, is it? And the patterns on them, there's a beautiful luster. Brand new. Wow. This is a launch that I'm about to do, actually. Uh, actually, forgive me, it's a three-strand pack. What am I doing? I'm separating them. You just mentioned... Oh, it is on its own. That's, the, that's my other pack, isn't it? Sorry, yeah. 18 millimetre. It, it, I've got a three-strand pack coming up in a minute. Um, wow. Wow. Limited. How many, honey? Right, we're starting with double figures. Let's put them up to there. We're starting with double figures. Yeah. I mean, you could just re-strand that. I think that would look lovely as well with the woods. It's got such gentle oranges in there. They're not like... How would you describe that? Well, I'll come over to Lucy in a minute and I'll ask her because I can see sort of... Caramel golds and like a little hint of like a tangerine orange in there as well. And these very milky chocolate browns, but the patterns are beautiful. But I'm only starting with double figures. 18 millimetres each. Oh, this is a bargain. Absolute bargain. Get the early bird, get this, and we can make up our own kit. These are Brazilian Jaspers. 850 carats. Wow. They are beautiful, aren't they? And I actually, funnily enough, we just looked at a little smidgen of what's in the second kit because this looks so nice with those pearls. So yeah, second kit of the day and there's nothing like this in that kit in terms of shape. So it really adds another dynamic, 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 uh, dynamic. Second kit of the day, this would look fabulous. Yeah, beautiful. Loads of you on the line there because we've all never seen it before. 12 95 under 13 pounds. I know, the Wonderstone. They're magnificent, aren't they? They are, I've never they, seen anything like no. it. <laughs> we've never had them before. Wonderstone Jaspers, you wonder, you know, how the beauty. Very, very striking, very dynamic. Beautiful and rich and they're going like hotcakes because there's a lot of regulars out there. So if you're new to Jewelry Maker, uh, it's Feta 63, F-E-T-A, Feta 63. It's gorgeous. 30 have gone and I started with double figures. So we need to act quickly on this one. 12.95, you've got, also if you're new to us and you don't already know, we deal in the gemstones as I said earlier, but anything you purchase, you have a 30 day money back guarantee. And here at Jewelry Maker, you'll only ever see real gemstones. And we'll talk about, I mean, in this case, they're from Brazil. Jasper is a beautiful, compacted gemstone. You get all wonderful, wonderful different patterns on beautiful Jasper, depending on the area and the location from which it comes. That's beautiful. So uh, being part of the challenge, Challenge Lucy, uh, what we're going to do today when I join my guest is give Lucy all of these components. And her challenge in the live show is to make jewellery up from it. So we can join in. If we like what she's made at the end of the day, if we've got the codes written down, if we've already purchased them, we've got our 30 day money back guarantee, we can emulate those designs. Or come up with our own creations as we will see in your entries this week for our weekly competition called the Wall of Fame, which again, I'll talk more about. But uh, here we go. This is a three strand pack, our boutique pack. And as um, Lucy quite rightly said there, lovely with the pyrite. You've got the zebra jasper. See, this is another jasper. These are the same family, but different look. And it's all to do with, again, you know, the minerals and the concoction of the rock and the way in which they morph into these beautiful gemstones. Um, it's all to do with the locations. And this one, I always think, looks like Neapolitan ice cream. It's like you've got the strawberry, the vanilla, and the chocolate. And you've kind of done a bit of a swirl in your bowl. And then... My red coral tubes, again, not a shape we see a lot on Jewelry Maker. And then the pyrite, the ancient fool's gold, from the word pyre, meaning fire, pyrite. It does look like a lovely antique gold. 
Another beautiful gemstone there. All three strands. Now I know this because this was a boutique pack, so high-end pack. Um, originally $14.95. But uh, you know, it's, that's not a high-end price, is it? No. Bargain now. $9.95. Under £10. Under £10. Bargain. And gorgeous with the Wonderstone. And there's only one other uh, little extra I've given our Lucy in today's challenge as well. So for this, I mean, again, you, you, what we've seen are those two, three, I mean, that's six strands. If we've got those pearls and the shell pearl plus these, that's six strands of genuine gemstones for under £20. It's like a bead box, isn't it? And I'm going to have a bead box extravaganza later as well. The only other thing I gave our Lucy, and this is, this is beautiful, isn't it, uh, are these large round hoops. It's a nine inch length of detailed gold plated silver chain, 10 millimeter hoops. So with those hoops, we can do all sorts of things. But we'll ask Lucy what she's going to do, what she's thinking. So these are the components today for the challenge. I love those. They are gorgeous, aren't they? And you can see the size of it. It's nine inches, very striking on, thick with the silver, and then the gold plating there as well. We can have dangles, we can have bracelets, we can, you know, you can cut the chain in, in, into lengths for your necklaces or your tassels. So your earrings, 20 pounds, but it is the gold plated silver solid chain. And it's not like a little bit of flimsy, flimsy. Now, the lady, I'm going to go and meet, made this from our first new kit. Do you have a look at Gemma? There she is. What do you think? Do you like this? Because uh, our first new kit is coming up and uh, Lucy's going to show us how to make that. So if you're thinking, actually, I've got my little LBD at home. I'm going to, I'd love to be able to make that. We'll be able to show you in our first new kit of the day. But let's leave, meet the lady who made it. She's called Lucy. And she's one of our guest designers here, a regular on the show. And honey, what are you thinking now that we've talked through your components? All these lovely things. I know, yes. lovely, lovely, <laughs> lovely. Um, well, I think with the chain, I want to split it up. Good. And put little chunks into necklaces, into bracelets, things like that. Maybe I like that. Earrings. I like that because... I always think I'm a bit simple, so I always think bracelet, but I always like to see it go so much further. Yes, yeah. I mean, you could just go Be inventive. for a, a simple bracelet and maybe have a couple of links for earrings. Yeah. But I want to break it up more. She can break it up. <laughs> she and I think it's it. going to go beautifully with um, the reds and browns. Yeah. It's going to work really what well. Do, what do we think of that Wonderstone? They're like little planets, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, <laughs> they're fabulous. They're the size of the planet, aren't they? They're beautiful. How would you describe that colour, Lucy? Because I was struggling there to... Can you see what I said? There's like a peach apricot yeah, tone in there. There's, there's, there's um, certain chocolates that oh. have like an, an orange centre. Yeah, it's kind of that pale orange. Yeah. So it's, it's a bit like, like a pistachio that. green in there as well, isn't yeah, there? Yeah, there's all sorts that come through. Which is great because it means you can put so many different things with it exactly. and it brings out the different colours. Exactly, yeah. Doesn't just have to, you know, be with the browns and what have you. No, it's so with all sorts. We're going to break up the chain. And then, you put your hearts in your hand. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was just looking at these. It was nice that they're actually quite subtle little hearts. Yeah. Because some people might not necessarily automatically buy a heart shape. It can be a bit past the chunder bucket. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Oh, we're all loved up and romantic. Yeah, oh, but these are, these are much more subtle and soft, so I think they're going to work really well. Romance isn't dead loose. <laughs> not on the show. <laughs> oh, past the bucket. Oh. Uh, sorry, go on, darling. <laughs> yeah, so I just think it's it's a nice addition to to have the softer heart. Yeah, exactly. And, the, the <laughs> and they they obviously sit nicely together as well. I know what you mean because I, I I'll be honest with you, I, I prefer the subtler if yeah. I'm honest because I, I, you know I don't, I don't I think you'd guess that I'm not hugely. <laughs> more You're not practical. A <laughs> Romancity, <laughs> romancity. Um, but yeah, a bit more subtler. Yeah, that's pretty. Yeah, I just love the colours on those. They do, they do look like the, there's a pastel quality, isn't there, with the pinks and the chocolates there. And Definitely, and everyone's different. So yeah, that's, that's true. That's going to be yeah. nice. So I think a, a few of those together Very and then broken pretty. up with, with something else would be well, work well. Lovely. Gorgeous. Well, we look forward to seeing that. Now, Lucy's going to take us through the technique. So we've actually, not just in terms of our subject today on the text messaging service, what have you made from watching one of our DVDs and also, um, what was mine? Oh, can you guess what my mystery pack is? Yes. Yeah. And if you guess right, if you're the first person to guess right, I'll send it to you for free. 
Um, you can actually ask, oh, I almost forgot what song, Marlon. Uh, you can actually <laughs> ask Lucy today if you've got any questions. Yeah, you know, if you're struggling with the technique, if you're new and just thinking, Lucy, how do I start? What else is going on in the show? Whatever you want to ask us, 60777, start your message, James Studio, because we want to make it very interactive. Now, an interactive part of the show that we also have is uh, our Wall of Fame. Now, our Wall of Fame is a weekly competition where you can win £100 worth of credit or 50 to spend with us here at Jewellery Maker. And in a bit, uh, Lucy and I will be looking at your designs this week and you send them in every week. We don't judge them, they just get plucked out of a hat. But before that, I want to show a bee box. Do it. So I'll be right it. back. I'll be right back. I want to show this bee box because it's so fabulous. And Jack, uh, my... It is this one, isn't it, darling? Yeah. Uh, Jack was saying to me, oh, this is gorgeous for you. And I was like, I know. And what did you say to me? It's very... So very 70s, very sort of psychedelic. psychedelic, yeah. Or even maybe 60s, very Barbarella, isn't it, with all those those colours. Now, this is a great, great um, strand, because again, straight away, I'm thinking of that lovely turquoise and that amazing, in fact, I'll have that to hand, that amazing Amazonite that we've got. And, um, oh, I've got some cracking blue appetite coloured jasper as well. Um, but look at these, this is what Jack's on about. I love the shapes in this box as well. It's not. It's not just about the colours or the gems, it's, it's the shapes, because that's something Lucy will explore as well. You know, it gives you, we were talking together about the, the puffy, twisty, du twisty diamonds, and um, they just give different articulation. Look at those. Oh, hello. Bit of turquoise in that three-strand pack later. Bit of pretty Amazonite. Mmm. Yeah, all going. Now, a bead box is brilliant because we put in six strands if you're new to us. And in it, we've got our 270 carats of our black onyx rounds. And this is... No, that's the, the, these, the nuggets. Forgive me, these are the nuggets. Look at this, this is a 90 centimetre strand. It's like a double strand, that one. Really long. So this is 270 carats. I then got 80 carats of my six millimetre Chinese rounds. China eyes rounds. I've then got my Howlite rondelles. Now these are the dyed Howlite, hence all those amazing psychedelic colour colours. So already we can see all these different shapes. I've then got my plain black onyx eight millimeter rounds, 150 carats. I've then got my twisted Howlite, 150 carats of the rice beads and that lovely psychedelic turquoise and the chocolate and the black there. And to finish us off, I've got my Howlite Puffy Ovals, 18 by 13 millimetres, 130 carats. And I've got my sturdy plastic box with the six compartments, which as regular jewellery makers will know, great for storing your findings, your loose gemstones, for laying your jewellery flat, because you could take out the little plastic compartments. And uh, great for storing your polymer clay, because it's the right plastic. Oh, yes, please. Um, I love that boy. Jack, I love Jack. I'm declaring my love for him on live on air. He said he'd make me a cup of tea. Um, right, this was a great price, wasn't it, Karen? Used to be twenty four ninety five. Used to be, used to coulda woulda, shoulda. But we're not stopping there today. Now again, don't forget, as a new buyer, with all our different findings. And my gorgeous regulars who will already perhaps have experienced the beauty of this box, maybe bought it, maybe thinking, actually, Fee, I'm going to get it while you, 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 that price is coming down. Um, you get your DVD and your booklet. If you want to start with a six-strand bead box, get some separate findings. Maybe you're mad about earrings. And you're just going to buy some earring findings on our website and just make hundreds of earrings, like I would. Or you re-strand your necklace. Or just, you know, we're going to get te techniques from Lucy. We've got techniques in our free DVD, techniques on our website, techniques from our Facebook family who are fabulous and always sharing ideas. 19.95 under £20 for six strands. £3.33 a strand. And whether you want to go for, OK, three different looks there, the black and the white, those black and white gems. Now, wouldn't those three look fantastic with the first new kit today that Gemma's sporting? Yeah, absolutely idyllic. And then these three are just beautiful for the summer. And once this bead box is gone, it's gone. No more. I love that with the browns in there, with the Amazonite coming up, with those mink and caramel pearls we had earlier. Ooh. And, oh, yes, our early bird. My early bird, the Rutile Twisty Oval Quartzes. 
Jasper, sorry, forgive me. So many gems flying around. That was that was a that was my late show review. Forgive me. Yeah, it's because it was the first thing I did. But let me just show you it with it anyway. Yeah. Let me show you that anyway. Fantastic with my early review. That was, they were 5 .95. And that's just using three of the strands. And then the early bird that flew in, that was the shell pack, wasn't it? Am I right? Am I barking up the wrong tree here? There we go. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, look at those colours. You wouldn't perhaps have put them there, but, you know, once you have a play, and Lucy will tell you this as well, you know, just have a play with those gemstones. Have a little look. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. So six strands. Get yourself a findings pack. I mean, I know yesterday you had a crazy price point. We were in the minus on that one, um, on a findings pack. That was, um, a findings pack is all sort of silver pieces like earrings and uh, chain and um, bolt ring clasps to finish your jewelry, crimp beads, head, head pins. These are the fundamentals of, of, of making your jewelry. And uh, you can just buy that separately on our website as well. You can actually buy the, if you're thinking actually, Fee, I'm new, I'm loving these colors. I'd to make something out of it, like those bracelets that you're wearing. Well, a findings pack has things like these. Can you see the bolt ring clasp with the jump ring? I mean, we put these in our kits anyway. And then the crimp beads, so you can finish off a bracelet perhaps made out of these gemstones that you're buying today. And, you know, these are techniques on your free DVD as well, new jewellery makers. So regulars will have seen this before. They'll have seen it at 24 95 but they're getting a chance like you at 19 95 Under £20? And again, don't forget that those black and white strands, perfect with our first new kit of the day. Absolutely perfect. Gorgeous. Now, shall we have a look at Gemma again? Because she's beautiful and she's sporting a stunning piece of jewellery. Now, can you see yourself wearing that? Can you even imagine yourself w making that? Well, I promise you, it's, it's doable. If you've never, ever started with jewellery maker, if you've never, ever made anything, or if you're regular and you're just thinking, actually, I'd love to rustle that up tonight. That's the beauty of it. If you're going somewhere and you haven't got the right jewellery, but you've got the gemstones, you can just rustle up something before you go out. Uh, then we are going to show you the brand new kit after this interlude and then come back with Lucy and she's going to take us through a demonstration to show you how to make exactly that with our first new kit. So you need to get the kit on order and then you can watch the technique and then you can make it. So don't go anywhere, you beautiful jewellery makers. I'll be right back after this. Add to your collection with our Beading Projects Edition 2 DVD, full of handy hints and tips for all levels. Join our guest designer, Linda, as she takes you through her step-by-step -step instructions for six different projects, where you will learn a variety of skills and techniques. To get your hands on a copy, phone our call centre now on 0800 644 655. If you have a question or query for Jewellery Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewellerymaker.com. You can now keep in touch by liking Jewellery Maker UK on Facebook. Get interactive with Jewellery Maker. New to jewellery making? Then why not come and join us on our Beading for Beginners course? Join guest designer Cherry Green as she takes you through all the basic techniques to create your very own necklaces, earrings and bracelets. You will learn a variety of skills, all of which will help you get started in jewellery making. During the course of the day, you'll get to have a backstage tour of the studios, meet the presenters and have a trip to our jewellery shop. The full course includes beading thread, a generous scoop of mixed gemstones, a 925 sterling silver findings pack, use of all relevant tools, a buffet style lunch and refreshments. All this for just £79.95. For details on course dates and availability, phone our call centre now on 0800 644 655. Jewellery Maker, bringing out the designer in you. Shop with us on Friday, Saturday and Sunday and you'll pay one delivery charge of just £4.95.
kit of the day and it's called Asteroid. And uh, you've had an inkling as to the colours of the gems and the types of gems that are there in the actual uh, kit itself. So these are the three beautiful pieces of jewellery because this is our high-end kit. So I know Lucy's remit was to make something very luxurious. It wasn't about the quantity of jewellery that she could make. It was about the luxury and the, and the finish of the piece. So we have that beautiful bracelet that I've been sporting uh, throughout. There we go. We have these wonderful earrings and we could talk those through with Lucy. And then of course, the necklace that Gemma is wearing so beautifully with her little LBD. Yeah, so we're gonna have a little look at that with Lucy. But first, let me introduce you to the kit so you can get the kit, okay? Now, new jewelry makers, remember what I said, because my beautiful regulars already know, and uh, I've got to do a big shout out in a moment as well when we get to that. Um, to somebody I met in the car park of a well-known supermarket. Um, with this kit, you get everything you need. When we're, when we're putting a kit together, we want to give you all the components to get you started. So not only will you get that free DVD, that free booklet, booklet about getting started with Jewelry Maker and you know our hub magazine about more about what we do here and behind the scenes and the courses you can go on. Um, you know, we'll have our guest designers every day and you with techniques about how to get involved. So regulars, this is what we're going to do and this is the kit. So let's take you through this amazing kit. It's our high-end kit. Every kit you're going to see today is under £25, so you already know. We've got these amazing black onyx rondelles faceted. Just look at that lustre. Beautiful rondelles, Tina's favourite. 290 carats. You can see why that uh, revisiting the, 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 the twisted jasper Zebra Jaspers, why I said it, it just looks so great with this kit. Um, look at that for sparkle and beauty. Then we've got our root tile quartz. Now this is without a shadow of a doubt one of the most expensive quartzes and it's because of rutilated inclusions growing within the quartz and on the gem market today it remains one of the most costly and can you see the size of those in this kit? I mean, that is 590 carats, 24 by 13, 13 by nine millimeter. And you get these little, they're metallic inclusions that grow like, well, I suppose metallic mites and stalactites. And obviously they're beautifully cut and polished. So you don't have them sticking out and stabbing you or anything like that. All these irregular nuggets and finished off beautifully. So you can really see, you have to be careful when you cut these because you want to see the most interesting patterns. It's a bit like when you cut your dendritic, agate or your dendritic quartz because those those levels of inclusions are going to occur at different depths at different levels within the gem structure so you know you want to bring out the most interesting rutilated patterns and uh, they're just extremely rare hence the expense normally when you're buying it and i can say that from a point of view of gems tv as well as jewelry maker uh, when i talk about the jewelry that we make with it then you've also got your black onyx drop style chips these are beautiful and so, they remind me of the black uh, piano keys. They're so polished and beautiful and bright. Next year, twinkling the ivories there and all just lovely irregular nuggets. Now, can you see why we've gone for this black and white theme? You know, that, those black and white gems that you just got in your six strand beady box fit in perfectly. But we've also thought about the cuts, the texture, the shapes, three very different shapes that are going to create very different looks in your jewelry. Now in this kit, the Asteroid Jewelry Kit, which is going like hotcakes, because the black and white is one of our best sellers. Anything, whatever those gems are, it's one of our best sellers. We've got all the silver, the fundamentals to make jewelry. Two pairs of shepherd hooks, so there's our two pairs of earrings. 10 crimp beads that you just saw some on the bracelet I showed you. Three bolt ring clasps with the jump rings and 10 sterling silver head pins which are great for threading on your gems for the earrings I showed you, great for making more shepherd hooks. Um, in the necklace that Gemma's wearing, they've created a dangle, a tassel dangle with the head pins. At the bottom there, four head pins. You see how they're threaded through and hanging from the rutilated quartz. Beading materials, beading thread, 150 meters sorry, 50 meters, 150 meters of monofilament. And we're gonna have a technique later on with Lucy with the monofilament in our third kit and then stretchy elastic. Now, well, I'm hoping we might. 
It, well, we're going to talk about it anyway, Karen, because we're going to ask you to actually pick the techniques, but we're going to talk about why we use the monofilament in, in one of the designs. Because I, I got some great questions on Thursday about somebody who was new to Jewelry Maker and asking about the mono, when would you use the monofilament and the beading thread? So we, we just want to introduce, because we're putting it in our kits now, because we know as regulars, you like to have the monofilament in there as well. So just talking about the uses of it. And the elastic, I'm a simple girl. I like just making stretchies as well. So everything, and even when we sell that beading thread, it's 3.95 separately. So, you know, when you put it all together, three strands of some incredible gemstones, all 925 silver, that's not a base metal, it's 925 silver, it's not the silver plate, you know, I'll always distinguish, it's not the silver look, it is 925 sterling silver. So 92.5% pure silver, all alloyed with other elements there. And 24.95, it's our high-end kit. And you can see why, but it's not a high-end price. I mean, that we were having a bit of a, you know, a chat today, and actually, I'll be truthful with your viewers. That was priced at twenty-nine ninety-five. Myself and Karen are thinking, yeah, but you know, we want to do something better for the regulars there, the new buyers. We want to get you involved, so we're going to be cheeky and take five pounds off. And it's so rainy out there. Let's let's just stay in and make beautiful jewellery together. And, for under, and because there's such other cracking deals today, you know, like the Amazonite and the turquoise three strand pack for the midday madness, um, we want you to get both, you see. One PMP all weekend. And maybe you're a fan, you know, you've got the black dress or you like wearing the black and white, or you can just, you know, in terms of selling your jewellery, um, I know the black and white goes like hotcakes because we've all got a black jumper or a black shirt or the black trousers or a black suit you know it's a very easy one to accessorize with and sell if, you, if that, you're into that side of the market beautiful isn't it shall we have a kit rundown and i'll take Gemma and various pieces with me over to see lucy and she can talk us through her designs there we go let's go and get Gemma and bring her over because that's what we're going to talk There's the kit rundown, everything you're getting. Thank you. Would you grab that for me, Jack? And then I can, thank you, beautiful. He's done that before. Thanks, darling. Can you sit, would you need to have that close to you, darling? Or should we put it between us? Let's put it between us. It's like an extra person here in the studio today, isn't it? Just live on my yeah, well, I can, I can, I can bring her into view, darling. So, because I know sometimes you like to see where you're just at. Check, yeah. There you go. So this is what we're going to do. But just very briefly, honey, just talk me through, you know, just just how you, what's the technique in these, just very briefly, darling. Okay, well, the bracelet is very simple threading. So you just thread on alternating the rutilated quartz and um, the onyx. Yeah. And then all I've done to finish it off is use a bolt ring clasp and crimped it off on both sides. And that's which... all in the kit and on our DVD, And isn't on it? the one that everyone gets yeah. to start with, so... That's on our free DVD as a new jewellery maker. Anybody could make that. Exactly. Whether you, it's the very first time you've tried it or not. Yeah, exactly. And that was the bracelet I was wearing earlier, if you liked that. Um, the earrings. I love this use of the... We were just talking about the head pins there, how you've used the head yeah. pin around your quartz. Basically, um, you don't have to cut off the little ball at the end when you're using it in different ways. So all I've done is, is wrapped it round so that the ball becomes a feature. Mm. So I've just passed it through and then hooked the end of the head pin around the ball. Gotcha. Yeah, beautiful. So you make a little loop at the top and then the and excess wire, it. rather than cutting it off, I've just hooked it around the ball. At the so front you've kind of, of the... picked two quartzes vaguely the same size because yeah. they're reg irregular, the same with the nuggets. And then up through a head just pin Just another attach, head pin with and then... two of the uh, rondelles and then attach that to the shepherd's crook. Yeah. So again, I mean, simple. while we're discussing this, we're going to show you the necklace, but if you've got any questions for Lucy, please text in, especially with regards to this kit. So obviously, if there's something else you want to ask that we haven't sort of just talked through, but this yeah, is what I'm you're going to show us, darling, isn't it? This lovely, this the lovely nice necklace. Luxurious yeah. One, yes. This is beautiful. Rest, yes, Look definitely. at that. Absolutely beautiful. And we were just discussing your finish there on your head pins, the tassel. Really, really pretty. So that's what I want to show you. Is yes, is please. We start with the tassel, and then I'll show you how it, it links in with the, the rest of it. OK. OK. So to do the tassel, um, the bottom bit is literally four head pins with one of the onyxes on each end. And then what I've done is just done slightly different lengths so that they don't sit all in the same place. They kind of move about a bit. So I 
If can I, I just, just darling, on. sorry to interrupt yep. you. Can I just move you over this way because oh, yep. our graphics obliterate what you're trying to show me. <laughs> I do apologise to interrupt. There we no go, problem. my darling. Yeah, you okay. see what so we can see now. So sorry to interrupt. So all I'm doing is literally thread on one of the beads right to the end. Now some of them you want to keep the full length of the head pin and all you're going to do is add a little loop on the end so that we can attach it to the rest of the drop. So you can do a wrap loop if you want but because I want length I'm just going for a basic Yes, you want, you want that dangle because you've got them all at different lengths haven't yeah. you? So all I'm doing is taking round those pliers and literally twisting my hand around to make a loop mm -hmm. and then you'll find you want to just twist it back in the other direction so it sits more centrally. Mm -hmm. Like there so. There go, lovely. So we do four of those at slightly different lengths. So we can see each of the onyxes, yeah. I mean, they're, they're fairly similar, but you could do a very short one if you wanted to. So same again, you just thread it onto the head pin. And you can either do it that you make your loop first and then cut off excess, or you could just snip a bit off first. Oh yeah, yeah. Like so. And just make a loop there so it's a shorter one. So again, just twist it round, nice and simple. The pliers do it for you because they're round. And just a little kink to make it sit in the middle. Okay. Excuse me, sorry, that's me clanging, I beg your pardon. I know we were shown some head pin techniques yesterday as well, so this yeah. ties in beautifully, yeah. Okay, so the next part is if you look, there's kind of a, another drop piece mm -hmm. here, yeah. which is what all those four will then link onto. So, with this, you, again, you could leave the ball on if you want. I will in this case just okay. to show you. And then you can make a loop just in the same way by putting your uh, pliers up close to the ball. Uh -huh. In the same way, you just do a twist and it, it gives you the ball at the front of the loop. Yeah, which is like nice. So. Yeah. Okay. So I'm just going to open that up slightly so that we can hook on all our ends, yeah. These ones we've just made. So we're just going to slide those onto the head pin. All four of them. Doesn't really matter which order, because they'll all find their own way. Just get them all into that bottom loop, like so. Very pretty. So we'll just close that loop up so they don't escape. Okay, and you're using close. the tools there. It's our starter jewellery making toolkit, which is the bottom of your screen. We'll show you the information for that when we have a little moment when we walk over to the Wall of Fame. So, uh, but it's basically the tools that you can see Hannah use. Lucy, sorry, darling. <laughs> it's all right. This is you wouldn't be the it. first. <laughs> I was doing so well though. I've done that for ages. Uh, Lucy's <laughs> using here uh, in the studio the little the, the round nose pliers yes. and what have you. Okay. So next, we want to add on one of the rutilated quartz yep. and one of the rondelles. So you just picked up random, have you, darling? Yeah, yeah. yeah I mean, they're, they're all so unique. Yeah. If, if there's one you particularly like, I would go for that yeah. as your feature one. Yeah. But you could use any. Mm -hmm. So simple threading onto there. And again, we need a loop at the top to add that to the rest of our necklace. So again, we just twist. Twist it around with the pliers and straighten it up so the loop sits at the centre. Okay, so there we have our tassel ready to go to be mm -hmm. added onto the necklace. Okay, beautiful. That make okay. a nice earring, quite frankly. Yeah, you could do it as yeah. earrings, and you can see they, they just kind of sit wherever they want to sit because they're all slightly different yeah. lengths. Okay, so the necklace part is actually three strands, which, um, if, you, if you can see on the necklace, it, it goes through rutilated quartz. Uh, and then it separates yeah. out into three different strands. Just separating into three there, isn't Which, it? when it's brought together, makes just like a nice sort of cluster, chunky kind yeah. of feel. So I've already laid this out so you can see you how just, it is. Just move oh, that sorry. Over. That's all right, my darling. We want to see it. You want to see we want it. want to yeah. see it. <laughs> OK, so you can see I've got three strands coming out of a rutilated quartz here. Uh -huh. 
So on the two outer ones, I've just used five, you could use any number of course, mm -hmm. of the nuggets. And then on the central strand, I've used three of the rondelles, mm -hmm. one of the um, quartz, yeah. and I've, I've picked lighter ones where I could there just to give a different look, mm -hmm. so you can see it basically. Yeah. And three more rondelles. Mm -hmm. Then what we want to do is make that cluster, and to do that, it's very simple, you just bring your strands together and put all three of them through another quartz. And the tighter you, you pull it together, the more bunched and clustered it'll look. And there's loads of that beading thread in the kit, isn't there? So, Tons. Yeah. It's always better to give yourself lots of, of wire anyway. It's, you're not going to run out quickly. So if you see there, it's quite loose. Mm -hmm. Just to make it more of a cluster, all I'm doing is literally pushing it up. Bunching it in a bit, yeah. And then I just sort of pop that rutile quartz out to the front. And it will sit there once it's tight. <laughs> Okay, Gorgeous. so that's one of your clusters. Mm -hmm. Then to separate that, I've just um, done it through a couple of the quartzes. Yeah, you've gone for three. You've gone for three there. Just to break it yeah. up a bit. Let me just grab a couple of other ones. And then you've repeated, am I right? You've done three and then on this next Yeah, so that, that goes all the way around. So you do your one side, and when you get to the centre bit, where you would add your drop on, you're literally just going to thread it on. These on. There's your three of them. And then you can um, bring it down to the, the centerpiece just using a couple of the rondelles. Mm -hmm. Again, just passing all three of the wires through the, the beads. Using these, these smaller rondelles close to that centrepiece just gives it a bit of space, really. So that you, your drop becomes a feature, a focal point. Yeah. And to add it on, all you're doing is getting the, the loop from the top of your dangle and threading the three wires through that. Ever so simple. And then you do another, another three on the other side and carry on up the other side. Separating it out to the, um, the three strands wherever you want to cluster. Mm -hmm. And you don't have to stick to the exact design, you can mix it up a bit. And then just put it wherever you want. But you'll see. Here have it's got space. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So and repeat. The, the dangle becomes the feature because you've got the space and then you come out and you get the clusters on either side. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful, Lucy. And there is the finished piece. So three gorgeous, gorgeous designs there. Entirely made out of the kit. And if I just show you the I'll just gonna show you the profile there. Because all Lucy's done after that cluster is just and again do the three quarters and then finish with the rondelles at the back because you don't necessarily want it all chunky around the back yeah. of the neck. Do again, you, for uh, comfort. It's, it's easier to open and close your clasp if you've got yeah, smaller beads true. around it so yeah, I just that was a few. good tip we had before yeah. yeah so yeah I'm sure you'll agree absolutely beautiful uh, we'll get some more uh, design tips from Lucy later as well remember if you've got any questions please send them in she's more than happy to help yeah but uh, I'm just going to go back to the kit now and revisit the kit so uh, here it is it's our first new kit of the day it's absolutely brand spanking new and you've got all of those gorgeous gemstones and that lovely high-end rutilated quartz in there as well and uh, for $24.95 not one to miss out on all of our kits today are under £25 you've got all the silver in there threading materials the gemstones alone I know quite frankly I mean I wouldn't price point that rutilated quartz anywhere below 15 um, as a strand itself, you know, given the beauty. And I'm giving you a jewellery maker price here, not a worth or a value. So when we've got the other two strands of the black onyx in there as well, um, plus all of our silver, plus all our beading materials, and it's, this is our high-end kit, so uh, make sure you've got that code written down. We'll get Lucy's designs uploaded on the website as well, so you, if you want to emulate them or copy them or come up with your own, then please do. <coughs> oh, <excuse me. laughs> joke. <laughs>
And don't forget, sorry everybody. Uh, and then you've got those Jaspers, the early bird that we had earlier, and three of those strands out the bead box. So there's a lot I know that's, and if you wanted to just add that punch of color, uh, hurry up, hurry and make sure you get yours now so that you don't miss out. Right, I'm gonna finish choking and uh, I'm gonna have a little look this week because uh, we're not the only ones to inspire you. You inspire us all the time with your fantastic designs. So I'm gonna ask Lucy to join me and have a look at some of your designs and we'll explain what the Wall of Fame is. Now these are your creations, your designs, you send in your design every week on a Wednesday we have a prize draw and as a uh, jewellery maker you can either win £100 worth of credit as the winner or as a runner £50 worth of credit to spend with say a jewellery maker. All you have to do is email us in and we'll get that up for you in the interval, our, our email address or uh, mail us in your designs. And, uh, you know, we'll try our best to show them. And if they're not shown, it doesn't mean to say they've not been entered. Uh, everything that comes in before the Tuesday, the day before, before one o'clock, does get entered into that week's Wall of Fame. And uh, Mark, yes, I did see your beautiful fluorite designs, gorgeous. Did you, you know, go in the buff and run down the high street? I don't know, that's what he said he was going to do. <laughs> it's a bit nippy yesterday to do that sort of thing. Uh, <laughs> because your design did get shown, but uh, ooh, uh, I don't know what they were doing. Well, I don't know how North Yorkshire cope with that one, but anyway. Uh, right, my darling. <laughs> <laughs> Who have we got there? Okay, number 45 is Soraya. Is that how you say uh, that? Yeah, mate. Oh, I, I hope we're pronouncing it right. I, I, so. I would have said Soraya, yeah. He says, Hi, Soraya. Jeff Buddy at Jewelry Maker. I love the programme. Watch it whenever I can. Here's a picture of my first ever bracelet using memory wire. You're a big inspiration. Thank you so much, Soraya. That is that is for absolutely first beautiful. Goes to your it? top, that it does. Gorgeous, that cuff bracelet. <laughs> it's amazing. Um, uh, forgive us if we're pronouncing the name wrong, but um, beautiful name, Soraya, Soraya, Soraya. Um, gorgeous. Uh, this is number forty-six, and this is from Sarah. And she says it's using agate, amethyst, pyrite, and silver findings. All from jewellery maker. I hope you like it. Have a great day, Sarah. Love it. We love it. It's number 46. Yeah, we love it. I've got 44, who I don't actually see a name on there. Oh, this is because I was asking on Thursday, what inspires you? Because uh, we had Italian charm bracelet bundles. Oh, and I was asking right. for people, where have you been on your travels? And we had someone on the locks of Sky, and uh, people were talking about places they'd been to that inspired their jewellery making. Oh, right. OK, brilliant. Okay, well they say, uh, please find and close my Wall of Fame entry. I'm watching your show now and I have sent a text with my Italian inspiration. Ah. Here is a photo of a necklace I made using the pink shell pearl from the Someplace in, in Time jewellery kit from JM. This necklace is a link necklace and was inspired from my travels in Italy. It does look very Italian, Beautiful. doesn't it? It's absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful, inspired by Italy, I love it. Um, inspired by nature on this one. Number 47, this is Linda from Banstead in Surrey, and she says, the flower is made of ebony wood beads, which are heaven to the touch. Uh, she says, this is my first attempt at a flower pendant. I have to thank you for all the skills I've learned at Jewelry Maker. I love all your programs, especially the demonstrations, which fire up my imagination and my credit card. Thank you for the best program on TV ever. Keep it coming. That's Linda in Banstead in Surrey. Well, thank you for the compliments there, Linda. And uh, thank you for sending in your gorgeous design. I'm glad you love the ebony wood because I think it's beautiful. You're number 47. Now, we've had a text. The text today was to guess what is my special fee parcel, as it were, package. And if you guess right, I'll send it you for free, the first person. But you must send your customer number as well. Um, and I was asking you, what have you made from our DVDs? If you've got one of our DVDs, to text me in and let me know what you've made. Uh, now, this is from Marianne in Canvey Island, or Tina's Deck of the Woods. She says, hi, Fee and Lucy. I've been practicing macrame and wire work flowers, doing the coiling. Now, she's guessing the gem strand is Jasper. So, Marianne, we have some other guesses that were wrong, by the way. Um, Marianne's actually guessed right. But I'm going to give Marion. Can Marion, can you text us again, Marion, from Canvey Island, and let us know your customer ID number? Because I've got to send it to you, darling. Um, obviously, I won't tell everybody that on the air. Uh, James Studio. But we're not going to end the competition, because I'll, I'll let you into a secret. It's not just Jasper. So, Marion, I'm going to send you my fee mystery package. Only when you send your ID in, because Marion, Canvey Island, I'll be. 
I've got no chance, have I? <laughs> exactly. Uh, so Marion and Camille, text, text me in your customer ID. You are going to get Fee's mystery package. It's also an amazing, an amazing price point for those of you who don't win. But uh, there is another strand in there. So the next person, the first person to guess what it is, will also, I'm going to give two, two of these packages away, will also win Fee's mystery uh, surprise. And what was that about the wall of... Yeah. Alice. Alice sent this in. Uh, the oh, Italian no, oh, the Italian. On there. <laughs> oh, gosh, no, I just realised, yeah. Alice, number 44. We love your Italian-inspired pieces. Now, I've got some fantastic, um, fantastic uh, bee boxes coming up. But while I'm on the subject of Marion and her macrame, um, I met in a well-known supermarket on Friday, lovely Lisa from Redditch and her father, John, and her mom. And John had made her this fantastic, almost like a Shambhala bracelet, the macrame, oh, wow. with four beads in it. And on the four beads were the letters L-O-V-E. And they were mad about jewellery making. So, mm, big shout out. It was lovely to meet you. Um, John, I mean, he just rustled it up the night before. They're all, the whole family's doing the, the jewellery making. Well, why not? Exactly. <laughs> so, Lisa, it was great to see you, because I know you texted into the show. Lisa from Redditch and all the family. So, uh, yeah, let me know what you've made from the DVDs and guess what's in my mystery package. Marion's won one. But the first person to guess what else is, what else strand is in that. But, Marion, we do need to know your customer ID, because I can't send it to you otherwise. But I will give another one away, because it's not just Jasper. Mm -hmm. And I'll try and get you the, uh, there we go, that's the macrame DVD that Lisa, and, or John and Lisa, that the, the, the family do, and uh, that Marion has actually made uh, practicing her flowers and her quilling. Right, got a break. Uh, loads more coming up. I've got some fantastic last in, last of stock in terms of the kits for new jewellery makers that want uh, maybe not just the black and white, but some more colour. We're going to get some more top sips from Lucy, so don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after this. The Jewelry Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewelry designer. And each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their Jewelry Maker account, and the runner up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com. Or you can post your photos to Wall of Fame, Coloured Rocks Limited, Unit 2D, Eagle Road, Moons Moat, Redditch, B989HF. Good luck! and happy jewellery making. You can now watch clips from Jewellery Maker on our YouTube channel. Get interactive with Jewellery Maker. We all know you need the right tools for the job, so here at Jewellery Maker we have designed a kit to make sure you have all the essentials to join in with the fun. With round nose, flat nose and wire cutter pliers, as well as a reamer, tweezers and a bead scoop, you've got everything in one place for just $9.95. We provide the tools, you provide the skills. When you're watching our day show or repeat show on the internet, you can hold up to two items in your basket at any one time. However, when watching the live late show between the hours of 5pm to 9pm, things are slightly different. Due to the stock quantity being live, you can only place one item in your basket before you must check that item out, giving a fair opportunity for all watching. Remember, you can only purchase items from the Live Late Show by heading to the Jewelry Maker homepage and clicking the Watch Us Live button. Enjoy the online experience with Jewelry Maker. If for any reason you're not satisfied, you have the benefit of our no quibble 30 day money back guarantee. Just complete the returns form enclosed with your goods and send them back for a full refund. Hi, welcome back. Now, I've got the most beautiful, beautiful strands for you, but can I show you my aquamarine? It's coming up later, and I actually worked out, given there are so many on this, they're working out, and I'm, it's given everybody a bit of a clue to the basics, because this is a beautiful aquamarine strand. I mean, really high quality. We've taken off um, practically 40% off the price for you today. Uh, in terms of where it should be, but each aquamarine, and so if we are thinking of making a pair of earrings, because these look so beautiful with pearls, and there were some lovely designs you sent in on Thursday on the Wall of Fame, um, 
Each one, you know, if you've made a pair of earrings, 64p each. 64 for a beautiful blue precious beryl 10 millimeter aquamarine. 64p each. So if they were set on a pair of earrings, even with a little pearl, you know those lovely mink pearls, blonde pearls we had earlier, that three strand pack for 795. And then each, I mean, what would you sell those earrings for, for genuine aquamarine on that beautiful strand? They're working out at 64p each. It's crazy, isn't it? But that's my high-end strand coming up later on. But first, before that, oh, and you know what would look beautiful with it? This is my Appetite Coloured Jasper. Look at these brand new today. Read all about it. Yeah, come on now. I'm absolutely in awe of these. Not seen anything like this on Jewelry Maker. How beautiful. Wouldn't they look nice with that bead box earlier? Do you remember the onyx and the, the dyed howlite? These are my appetite colours. I and mean, you can see why it's given that distinction. It's the, the blues, isn't it? You see those little, like, almost like flecks of, it looks like a, a kind of a, a labradorescence. Can you see that at home, everybody? That I can see here. Are you catching that, darling? Yeah. Yeah, it's amazing, isn't it? Can you see it's like, it's like lightning strikes? beautiful isn't it it's just there beneath the surface on certain bit par parcels of the gem it's just gorgeous little flecks of like beams of light um oh yeah i mean the more you look at it the more you find it it's just, they're, just, they're there oh that's beautiful these are huge 660 carats 16 millimeter and again you know you could put those with your black onyx you could put those with the blues of your lovely aquamarine you could lift it with the brighter blues of your chalcedony or your lovely dusty blues of your um, aquamarine or the lovely cream of your pearl beautiful i mean look at this this is incredible shiller of light beneath the surface of these jaspers these are a very unusual jasper i've never seen that property in a jasper i'm absolutely amazed can you see that at home it's like, it's like a venture essence, isn't it? It's like, it must be a different type of um, optical property because obviously you don't tend to get that in your Jaspers, but gosh, it's amazing, isn't it? I can't absolutely, can you see that, Lucy? Yeah, it's beautiful. Isn't that beautiful? And that's on, the, on all, all the gems in different varying degrees, but four. Um, half the stock remaining, because while I'm, you know, loving up the, uh, the blue Jasper, uh, the Appetite Colour Jasper. Look, there's another one with loads of it. Uh, you're, you're buying, which is brilliant. Oh, my word, this is a sensational offer. This is an amazing offer on our Blue Appetite Jasper. I know, 9 95 under a tenner. You and I have not seen anything like this huge 16 mil. If you had to pick a gemstone to put with it, Lucy, what would you plump for, honey? Oh, Looking at that beauty. So many options. Maybe just um, some clear crackled quartz. Ooh, just something extra sparkly, yes. but then to, to spread sparkly. it out as well. The sparkly would pick up those would nice flecks. Yeah, it would work really nicely, but you yeah. could put so many things with it as well. Definitely. Colours and things. It's a beautiful colour, isn't it? And it is a darker appetite blue. It's not like a denim blue, and it's not like your azure blue. It's, a, it's, a, it's an appetite blue. And under £10, limited stock already? I've got one other strand later, but they're the smaller puffy ovals, just to make that distinction. So if you want to get both, I'll show you so you know what you're getting on Jewelry Maker and they're genuine gemstones. That's the puffy ovals coming up later, but please don't miss out on my large 16 millimeter Appetite Jaspers now at 9.95. I would put those with the uh, Amazonite. They're almost gone. Oh, I lo oh, look at this with my Amazonite. My, well, this is my three strand pack later, but I'm gonna bring you some Amazonite now in a minute. Look at that. I'm gonna move on to an Amazonite. Oh, that looks so hot. Uh, right, talking of Amazonite, because this is a, a, in its purest form. Um, well, if you're quick enough to get that, I've got some lovely dog tooth uh, amethyst as well. But this is a natural gem. This is a gem that's named after the river Amazon. And as I say time and time again, but please forgive me regular to repeat myself, but it's for the benefit of the new, the new jewelry makers out there. It takes its name from the river Amazon, but we don't source it from there. We get it from Brazil and we get it from um, Zimbabwe. Uh, there's places all over the world, but predominantly Brazil. Natural gem, a natural gem that is called the Hope Stone. 
They say it's a gem of prosperity and good fortune and a gem for the lovers, the married lovers. I don't know why you have to be married. Can you not be a lover? If you've got to be married, but apparently that's the, the, the folklore, the legend. So if you're under the brush like myself, you've got no chance. There's no good fortune coming your way. It's not going to stop me. Uh, let's have the Amazonite. This is brand... Well, is it brand... It's got a great price point. It's one of my new... It's a late show review. Review. Natural. And it always looks like the blues of the water cascading over the pebble-like surface of the river. And um, it's a beautiful natural gem. You get it in those lovely mint fresh spearmint greens, those honey blonde gulls. Do you know what I want to put it with? You know those lovely honey blonde pearls from that three strand pack, that early bird? I mean, because there's such lovely pretty gulls in there. Oh my word, it's mermaid jewelry. Look at those two. Do you like that? I love that. I really like that. Very vintagey. Yeah, the pearls just. You see, that was in the early bird, wasn't it? That three-strand pack for $7.95. There's at the bottom of the screen. Those lovely mink blonde pearls. They're such a gorgeous colour. They're very easy to accessorise with. But I've got an amazing opportunity. And Amazonite looks great with black. There's your price point. $7.95. That was the old price point. What am I talking about? I love Amazonite with black onyx as well. Look at those. That's gorgeous. It makes the mint. Oh, five ninety-five for that Amazonite. Five ninety-five under six pounds. You see, we review sometimes those little fantastic, well, massive offers on the Late Show, just simply because you might have missed it. And also, I love Amazonite. I'm obsessed. Beautiful. Actually, this would look so pretty with the goals in my second new kit today. Look at those. Oh, sunshine and water. Yeah, the second new kit, which I am going to show you soon. But what I want you to do is pick your technique that you want to see Lucy demonstrate. So uh, so bear with me. It's our second new kit of the day there. So make sure we've got the Amazonite going quickly. Yeah, we don't want to miss out under six pounds. And actually beautiful with the Spearmint Amazonite triple pack, the Midday Madness, the Midday Magic at 12 o'clock with the turquoise. And we're taking a good eight pounds off that, that three strand pack. Should have done, but myself and uh, Karen have been naughty this morning. We know it's raining and horrible out there, so let's make it cheery and bright inside. We want to make everybody, we want everybody to be making jewellery, actually. That's what we want. Let me know if that's what you're doing as you're watching. Beautiful. Right, let's bring you my second new kit, because what we're going to do um, is literally show you the kits, show you all the components, and then show you the jewellery and let you choose what you want to see, because we choose what we think you want to see, or perhaps what we haven't demonstrated recently. Um, and really, it's your show. Now, this is called... Really? Pumpkin Seeds. I'm already sold on the Botswana. That's me gone. I'm a, it's a done deal for me. Uh, pumpkin seeds, because we've got these gorgeous orange and golds. Now, I'm going to start with the golds there that you just literally saw me hold with the Amazonite. And these are my 260 carats of happiness. I'm only starting, literally, I'm going to be in double figures in a second. And this is our second new kit of the day. These range from 12 to 14 to 8 millimetres, 260 carats of sunshine brilliance. And just look at the high refractivity. That's light bending at an angle as it enters the crystal substance and the amount of light you get back to your eye. It's really high. That's why we're seeing such a luminescent brightness. Then, ah, oh, the magic! That's right! 280 carats of pure heaven. Pure, delectable magic. If you've never seen Botswana, then you need, you have to make sure you've got Botswana in your life. I will not be a happy bunny until everybody's experienced the beauty of Botswana. Because as far as I'm concerned, it is the best. It is absolutely beautiful and gentle and distinctive and perfect in those large nuggets, 280 carats. And then the other, the pumpkin magic is our Mystic Sunset Quartz, 70 carats, six millimeter rounds. And look at those with a mystic coating of pinks and rainbow glamour. Ooh, hot, hot, hot. Feeling hot, hot, hot. Oh, would you look at the clarity and the luster and the sparkle. It's just amazing. 
just if you just see that quartz that mystic can you see the rainbow iridescence on the surface because unless you see this in the flesh anybody's bought our mystic gemstones appreciates that how beautiful how even more beautiful that is in the flesh if you get all of that rainbow iridescence on the surface so three gorgeous strands don't forget all your silver new jewelry makers don't forget your beading thread your monofilament your gift bags i didn't show you that before did i you get two more gift you get two gift bags not just for storage within the kit but for actually making something and giving it as a gift one large one small and on it they're labeled hand made gemstone jewelry so if you're giving it as a gift if you make some jewelry and you give it away they know you handmade it so rather than our logo it's your logo your generic logo something that you made monofilament beading thread elastic already down to double figures pumpkin seeds brand new today monofilament there elastic bead 21.95 you've got all that silver these beautiful beautiful gemstones that are so different and bringing something to the party and then all your silver there now you've seen some designs already made out of that silver with our first asteroid kit but for me look at the banding on that botswana pebble-like colors with the orange and the bronze and the silver i mean just look at these this is how beautiful the linear beauty is look at that look at that banding gorgeous absolutely beautiful and then the clarity on our quartz our honey lemon and then the rich vibrancy of that mystic quartz beautiful and again different shapes more sort of parcel angular squares beautiful polished large nuggets of Botswana and then perfect symmetry in your six millimeter faceted quartz rounds so very different shapes to explore now we've got one two three four five pieces of jewelry made out of this kit we're going to ask you to actually choose which demonstration you'd like in about 20 minutes time from uh, Lucy and I'll just take you through the jewelry pieces and I'll uh, number them for you okay so I'm going to number this Number one, this is number one. My lovely, pretty Mystic Quartz earrings. This is number one, if you want to see this demonstrated. Num this is all made out of the kit, okay? Number two, my beautiful necklace, incorporating all of the gems and that weave work there. Can you see that little, it's almost like a quadrant weave. That's number two, okay? Number one, number two. Number three. So th I'm really asking you to text me into 60777. You can text in as well to let me know uh, what you think is in my mystery pack and what you've made from your DVDs that you bought from us. So this is number three. So, uh, you know, one text can serve all. Let us know if you want to see this demonstrated by Lucy. Number four, the bracelet. It's not for me to choose, it's for you. Or last but not least, demonstrated by the lovely Gemma, number five, okay, number five. Would you like to see how to make the necklace? So we've got a bracelet, two necklaces. I mean, that pendant is just beautiful, isn't it? With that mystic quartz. Gemma's got a nice collection, hasn't she? Five very ample, very ample, I'm sure you agree, very striking pieces of jewelry. So. Earrings number one, second necklace number two, second pair of earrings number three, bracelet number four, Gemma's necklace number five. So let me know, and we'll show you the text message in service. And Marion, have you sent me your customer ID? Because you've won Fee's mystery package, she has, brilliant. But I'm, I'm still gonna give another one away because she got one of the gemstone strands, Jasper, but there's another one in there. And you know what, for those of you who don't win, we've got a winning price when I launch it because no one's seen it for this price point. We've got our massive Reduccio. Gorgeous. And actually, it would look fantastic with this kit. There's a big fat hint. Uh, it would look fantastic with this kit. All right, let's move on because we're going to have a, a, a breathe, a pause uh, there for you to literally choose what demonstration you want to see with our pumpkin seeds kit. And I'm going to bring you some limited stock kits. So new jewelry makers, don't forget, get started DVD and booklet. Hub Magazine, we're here to help. Text us in. 
All right, I'll tell you what I'm going to go for. I'm going to go for code NPGP75. Now, in all these kits, you've got your beading materials. Whoa! I, we don't repeat kits often. Basically, these will have been shown on the live show, like a brand new kit like this. They will have been demonstrated by a guest designer. But we've got the last of stock. Oh, I love this. This is just rainbow magic. Look at these. My word, four strand kit. This is called, how would you pronounce that, Lucy? Who pressed today? What, what does that mean? A family of iridescent beetles. Boo press today. We learn something new, don't we? Um, there you go. Well, we can see why. Look at those iridescent, beautiful rainbow hematite donuts. 12 millimeters, 200 carats. The large black agate, 40 millimeter faceted rounds, 475 carats. And then these beautiful irregular. Mm, Agate medium nuggets, 200 carats with the blues and the pinks and the purples in there. And then my perfect six millimeter faceted agate 90 carats rounds. So four amazing strands, four beautiful strands bringing loads to the party. Boupress today, plus your monofilament beading thread elastic, plus all your silver new jewelry makers as well as the gorgeous regulars. Everything you need lost. Remaining few in stock. $24.95 and it's four strands. So limited stock, but you know, I, I never saw this kit launched. It's like a second bite of the cherry, but you can see that being the second time on air that we, we're starting with limited availability. Love these colors. Look at these, um, Tom, in the close up. Look at those. Look at those colors. Are they beautiful? That blue, the banding in those agate nuggets. And you don't have to use them all together, obviously. They're just very different. Gorgeous, in fact. Beautiful. And I love these. Look at these, the donuts with that. Can you see that, that color, that iridescent color on there? It's rainbow beauty, isn't it? Such fun really tie in lovely with the agate nuggets and then we've got those two fantastic uh, black strands i mean they would look great because you mix and match your kits with the asteroid earlier wouldn't they they look great with the asteroid great with our third kit coming up as well so this is bupress today iridescent beetles just because of the colors but fantastic color fantastic beauty yeah Beautiful, mystical rainbow colours there in your agate and in your hematite. But we're low in stock, so don't forget free tutorial DVD and booklet with your first order. Really want to encourage... And actually, if you put in the code MPGP75 into the website when you log on on www.jewelrymaker.com, it'll bring up the designs that were made by the guest designer that day. All righty. This is code number FZGP57. Light a day, remember this one, and you'll see why. Because there are these big, they look like dried apricots coming out. Look at the size of these whoppers. My word, there wouldn't have been much left in that gem mine when I've extracted these beauties. Because we can wire wrap these. These are my huge, huge natural agate large nuggets. And they'd look like beautiful syrupy apricot, dried apricot fruits, don't they? Look at the colours on them. Amazing. And then, woo, pop. Chinese jade, eight millimetre. Hot, hot, hot. Whoa, look at those colours. Serious, serious sizzling summer. And then our four millimetre denim blue, dusty denim blue faceted rounds in the Chinese jade, the quartzite as well. So, for light of day, it used to be 1995, but for the last remaining few in stock, 1795. So again, jewelry makers that are new to us or regulars will know if they love this, they'll be in there for it. Um, you get that DVD, you get that booklet. We've got more demonstrations to show you. We've got a Facebook family of, of 
regular viewers happy to help and come up with designs and help you with anything you're trying to do or, or discover or emulate? Maybe a design that you saw in a shop you want to copy or something in a magazine. And we deal in real gemstones here. And all your silver as well, yeah? Because your jewellery that you're making, and this is why a lot of people go into business and sell their jewellery, is silver. Silver findings, genuine gemstones. I tell you what, we look lovely with that. That incredible appetite jasper. I'm just thinking of those dusty denim blues in that Chinese jade. And then maybe the pop of the pink, maybe you want to take it down a different direction. I mean, I've got one more strand of that later on, or even with the fruity, fruity licious. Gorgeous, gorgeous. I'll bring you that other appetite jasper strand later, but I've got that, oh, but I love my Amazonite. Oh, that's coming up as well. So very, very different. You can wire wrap, you know, those of you that love the Rachel Norris designs. Um, we do a wire course here as well at Jewelry Maker, don't we? Is that with Louise? Yeah. Wire work DVDs as well. Let me know what you've been making from our DVDs. No one's guessed yet. What's in my pack, apart from Marion? She's getting it, but there is something else other than the Jasper in there. We'll check. We'll check in a bit. All righty, we'll keep that competition open. Uh, next one, next one. Oh, I'm going to go for these Mahusivs. Uh, this is VSNG40. Caramel toffee pie or banoffee pie. I mean, I want to put these with the Wonder Stones that uh, Lucy's working with this morning. These are... 20 millimetres of Adventurine. Red Adventurine rondelles. Ooh. And then 150 carats of Tiger's Eye. Eight millimetres. Whoa. That's lovely, isn't it? Lucy's look tasty, 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 <laughs> says Lucy. You betcha. Used to be 20, around 24.95. Oh my heavens, that is gorgeous. That tiger's eye, that faceted rounds of the tiger's eye. It was reduced on the evening show, which is five till nine. You can watch the, the, the one tonight. 21.95. I know, that's amazing. 1,000 carats of the Caramel Adventurine, 290 of the Red Adventurine Rondelles, 150 carats of the yellow tiger's eye, 21.95. And then watch the late show tonight, I think. Is it uh, Jenny tonight? Yeah. Beautiful. Actually, they, these three would look great with our um, pumpkin seed kit. I'm just thinking of the mystic quartz with the oranges, the Botswana there with the tiger's eye. The browns, gorgeous. What a fantastic kit. I mean, it's effortless. You've got all your silver, all your beading materials there. And even better, great low price, but in limited stock, we're revisiting some already price slashed pieces. Okay, one more for the reduced kit. I've got a great uh, section as well on my bead boxes. And this is, well, you know what it is, because it's the last one. Shimmering stones, yeah. Ooh, color, 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 color. Wow, liking these. There are some little extra gem spaces in there. Well, they actually might be beautiful. Actually, you know what I want to put in with this? My Hypersh theme. I'll show you that in a moment because it's brand new today, but let's just see what we've got going on in the kit. We've got the jet. Now, these are actually black amber, the jet, so they feel very, very light because amber isn't a very dense gemstone. You know, often amber can float. So beautiful it's a lovely chunky look but very light it's deceptively so and then you've got multicolor eight millimeter faceted agate and then you've got red agate six millimeter faceted rounds more of an orange than a red but i want to put in there theme. that fantastic new gemstone we've got coming up as well that new strand i should say that beautiful beautiful gemstone with that gorgeous gorgeous shimmer well it's something we don't see very often, isn't it? It's coming up later. It's another strand I'll be revisiting, but I rarely see it on the show. Shimmering stones, though, is what we're talking about. All the silver in there. Gorgeous. Was that the launch price? Goodness me. And we went lower than 17.95. So as a new jewellery maker, um, you've got a 30-day money-back guarantee. 
these are the faceted agates with the black, the red, the green, the white. The sparkle of the faceting is beautiful. The large, gorgeous jet nuggets ranging up to 36 millimetres. And then the pretty pot of the six millimetre agate. 17.95. There we go. Now I'm asking you to choose what you want to see us demonstrate in our pumpkin seed kit, which we launched, and we will revisit. But I'm going to take you through the designs yet again. It had the Botswana. It had the lovely shimmering citrine. It had the gorgeous mystic quartz. Uh, somebody's already asked for number five, which is the necklace Gemma is wearing. So uh, we'll just go with the majority vote. So this is number five. We'll go backwards. This is number five. Would you like to see that made? Would you like to see the Botswana bracelet made? Would you like to see the Botswana silver earrings made as a demonstration? Would you like to see necklace number two made with all of the gemstones from the shimmering pumpkin seeds? Or number one, the simple drop earrings. Mystic quartz earrings, yeah. You decide, you choose. Uh, so far the winning text is, well not the winning text, but the winning, the majority vote is the number five, but it's up to you. 60777, start your message Gem Studio. Guess what's in the Fees Mystery Pack? Um, and let us know what you've made from our DVDs. This is the subject for today. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay, now, can I just show you these? They're coming up at 12, it's my midday magic. It's Amazonite and turquoise. We've taken eight pounds off where we should be in terms of the price. Isn't that beautiful? So please don't miss that at midday. But first, let's have some beadbox magic. It is called the Jasper and the Shell. I've got it. Got it. All over it like a car bonnet. I'm on it like a bonnet. Uh, let's look at this. Yes, I think I've got the right one. Yes, I have. Here we go. Now, I love these shapes because I'm going to pick this out straight away. And um, Mark, come on the show. If you want to see more men's jewellery made, let's get Mark on the show. Um, Mark in North Yorkshire, because I think this would make great gents jewellery. Because I see a lot of this in your fakes in the stores. A lot of those shapes, just stranded like that, or maybe with a pendant on. Very beach, very surfer dudish. These are your beautiful picture jasper cubes, six millimetre, 100 Then we've got the tubes. The picture jasper tubes, 12 by 8 millimetres, 200 carats. Again, I think that really lends itself to gents' jewellery. Then, that's not for me to say, though. I mean, it's up to you. The puffy ovals as well. 18 by 13 millimetres, 180 carats. It's a B box extravaganza. And, oh, these are delicious. My shell pearl 6 millimetre rounds. Look at that colour. Wouldn't that look lovely with the early bird, these colours? Because we've also got... The bronze shell diamonds, 23 by 17 millimetres. Mm, lovely shapes to explore. And then my bronze shell fancies. Mm, fancy that. Look at those. Really beautiful irregularity. Just fancy shapes. Six strand jasper and shell bead box. Plus your bead box, yeah, mustn't forget the beady box. Originally 1995. Great price, yeah, but not where we're stopping. It was originally working out at £3.33 a strand. Including your bead box. How about each strand being reduced to £2.83 a strand? You've already done the maths. £16.95. For the six strands, two pounds eighty-three a strand, not to be missed, and fantastic with that early bird. There's a lot in this actually that would look nice in our pumpkin seed kit. So I'm looking at the colours. Let me just get those strands. You know the pumpkin seed kit, which you, when you're choosing the demonstration. What do you think? Do you think those go? They do, don't they? The pumpkin seed kit. So, you know, new jewellery makers, don't forget, you can get a beady box, you can buy one of our kits, you can get our extra threading materials on the website, our silver findings, our gold-plated findings. Might be a last chance, though, because these are the last chance saloon beady boxes. 
getting very limited now because everybody loves a bargain and our regulars love to increase their store even if they're not sure what to make with them right now phone lines have lit up you know it's just increasing your store getting a bargain yeah we all love a bargain yeah can i just say that uh, the code was right on those graphics but it was rattling all about the pumpkin seeds that keeps happening doesn't it it's very bizarre um so the code is coming up right but it's telling you the graphics for something else i know it has been brought up my darling i know so we'll get that graphic back in the, the actual code was right though it gave you the description of our pumpkin seed box our, our, our new um kit our second new kit today i should say rather but our bead box the code will bring back up rtp 13 if we're talking and you ring in and you can hear me and you're on the web or the live feed there it's r for roger t for tommy p for percy o for uh oh and then 13. RTPO13. And it was, what was the price? 1695 Going quickly. Yeah, we'll get that uh, up with the right description, but you did actually have the right code there. Mmm. Oh yeah, fantastic. Love those. Love the different shapes. Love the fact that it does lend itself to the gents' jewellery. But then you've got the lovely shimmering evening light colours. It goes beautifully with the pumpkin seed new kit. Keep your text coming in for which design you want us to show you in terms of a demonstration. Because it's, it's all very well our, our us choosing, but perhaps that's not what you want to see. There we go. Got the right graphics now, but we had the right code. And there at the bottom, don't forget, is that three strand, the early bird. Let me just grab the early bird for you. If I put that over the box there, you can see all those beautiful gemstone strands. Uh, the early bird, because it ties in so beautifully at the bottom of your screen there now, the 7.95, and again, adds another dynamic. Because you've got the shell pearl in there. Look at those. Ties in beautifully. Ties in beautifully, would you agree? Yeah, looks gorgeous with it, doesn't it? Yeah. All righty, new in. New in. Let me show you these and let's just talk about the quality. Let's stop everything because this is important. We've got a very important guest in the studio. This is a very precious gemstone and beryls in their natural form are pure white. But when you get rich elements of minerals, that literally is lava forcing its way between the crevices and the cracks of rocks because beryls is a metamorphic gem so meta and morphing meaning changing shape when you get elements of iron with the beryllium creating aquamarine it is a very precious entity and that white beryl now becomes aquamarine this is how your emeralds form you, 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 but with the elements of vanadium and chromium this is how uh, morganite forms with the elements of manganese these are working out if you were to purchase them from jewelry maker and these are genuine beautiful polished 10 millimeter aquamarines they're working out at 64 pence each it's a very high-end strand, and myself and Karen have negotiated 40% reduction from the original launch price that you won't know yet. And the deeper those blues, obviously we're not going for the clarity, but the trade-off is that amazing claret way, and you've still got those beautiful blues. And the more prominent those blues, the greater the value of your aquamarine. When you couple it with clarity, of course, you're onto a win-win, but we have coupled it with a fantastic claret way, and you can clearly see those beautiful blues. We've got semi-translucency. What does that mean? It means it's not fully opaque. It means you can actually see light traveling through and giving a glow within the aquamarines which you would expect, the water blues, you'd expect that from your high end. Now, again, I'm, the reason I say 64 pence each, and you're left with about, when I worked it out, about 14 peel at the end, is because although this is an extremely high end strand and is one of our higher price points, the value is in the gemstones. The value is in the amount of gemstones. And when you separate them and actually say to yourself, actually, okay, I've got two silver findings for a pair of earrings, and I'm making those earrings for basically one pound 28 an aquamarine pair of earrings. I mean, you're not gonna pay that for a pair of aquamarine earrings, whatever shape or form. 
you wouldn't even pay that for plastic. It would be more, wouldn't it? And I know you've got to pay the price of your silver earrings, maybe, findings, but, you know, we build that into our kits. We sell them separately on our website, all sorts of connectors and what have you. And it is limited. I'm only starting with double figures for this beautiful blue of the gem world. I mean, people know the value of the aquamarine. People understand it as one of the most beautiful semi-precious gemstones. Um, double figures have already sold out, gone. I've, I've still got availability, but they're going in the tens now, okay? People aren't buying 10, but what I'm saying is 20 have already gone. So we need to act quickly because I am starting with limited availability, okay? So maybe this might be a strand to split with a friend. I can see on the phone lines, gorgeous quality, perfect with the pearls, it's approaching 50% of the stock availability gone now. So we do need to act quickly and we've taken 40% off the launch price. Here we go, $29.95. You've got approximately 39 gemstones on this strand. Uh, so, you know, that is working out at 64p each. And there goes Jack with all my bits there. Half the stock's gone, so well done to you. It is a high-end strand, but it is a high-end gemstone, and you can see that quality. When you work it out per gem, you really get to grips with the extent of the saving in this beautiful blue beryl, this precious aquamarine aqua, the mare, the blue of the sea, that gorgeous gem for the travelers, for the journeymen, that gorgeous, gorgeous aquamarine, beautiful, precious beryl, one of the most famous. And it looks fantastic with the blues and the watery blues, for instance, of not just the appetite color jasper. I mean, not just with that that I've got coming up, my second new strand. It looks fantastic if you want to mix up the blue greens of Amazonite, because it's those watery gemstones, you know, in their basis and the turquoise, you know, if you mix up those blues, that three strand pack that I've got coming up, yeah, it just really looks fantastic. And with pearls, I had a wall of fame on uh, Thursday with the beautiful pearls coming up as well, and I love it. I mean, did you get the, the big appetite Jasper? I mean, look at that, we loved that combo earlier. So well done if you did. That sold out earlier, all got allocated, so well done. Make sure you're quick to act on my beautiful second strand. Please don't miss out. Beautiful with white quartz, beautiful with white pearls, exquisitely expensive in terms of the look of the jewelry, but you know, 29.95. I'm down to 35 left in stock. Because you know when you, I mean, I, the reason I broke it down like that is because I know a lot of you out there sell your jewellery. And if you're going to price point a pair of aquamarine, aquamarine earrings, you're not going to be price pointing them even, up, even with the silver at £1.50, are you? I, I would actually doubt as a customer that it was genuine if the price was £1.50. I'd be going... It would. It's, it's reverse psychology, isn't it? It's, there's something I explain over and over again on Gems TV, you know, about how we go so low in terms of visiting the mines, going direct. And because I think sometimes people believe the precious beauty more or the quality of the piece if the price is higher. It's like a psychology because if it's low, you think it's you think it's cheap or redundant or there's something wrong with it. I mean, I was just I managed to Skype Scott last night. Hooray! It's only taken about three days. He's in Tanzania, Lucy. Oh, they were down the Tanzanite one mine yesterday. Brilliant. This is going direct with Steve to source the gems. Yeah. And this is what we do. We cut out the middlemen. It's up come out Kilimanjaro as I speak today. I did ask for a nice triple A and I want it to be four carats plus, please. Oh, I, would I mean, because I'm minding the fort here. I'm working and minding the baby. It's the least it can do, isn't it? Definitely. But my point <laughs> being, and also actually what he said, one of the best days was yesterday because he visited what we do in terms of our charity work. And the Maasai herdsmen, uh, as you know, live in Tanzania and they live in these clay huts and they have these little um, burners within the clay hut. But it's really um, detrimental to the children's lungs and obviously their lungs because you've got smoke filled. So they make these like, little um, burners, the charity does. They cost one pound to make. For every Tanzanite we sell, we contribute one pound towards the charity and they, they get them to... Um, literally grow the materials that they need to make these little wood burners to then put in the, and it's like a 60% redu reduction in the emissions in the hut. But he said it was very humbling just to see the charity work that was done with the mass. I'm rambling now and I've gone off on one. <laughs> 
there's a bit of background to what we do here, isn't there? It's a bit of background. Occasionally we see Tanzanite here on the channel, but it's nice to know, you know, about your gemstones and where they come from and all that. Now then. Oh, a late show review. A review, a review, a review, review. A late show review, review. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Step in time. Let's do it. I'll tell you what, my legs are aching from all the dancing Thursday night. Back of the calves. Oh, I'm crippled, Luce. I'm crippled. Right. This is a late review redo. This was on the show and it was stepping time, the jewellery kit, comprising of these beautiful gemstones. So don't forget your new jewellery makers. You get your DVD, you get your booklet about how to get started with this here at Jewellery Maker. You get your Herb magazine. Actually, the Chosen by You is all about the Jubilee. So let's party with a bit of that later on as well. Visit our website, sign up for our monthly email, visit our Facebook and Twitter pages, visit our studio workshop, grab our tutorial DVDs for free new jewellery maybe shows on free view, free sat, virgin, 24 hours a day. Oh, I know. Taking over the world. Now, fire agate, look at this. This was previously launched at 27.95. It got reduced on the same day, a launch price reduction of 24.95. And it has been seen as low as 19.95, but today, with our gorgeous, gorgeous, amazing reduction again today. Shall we take you through what we've got going on? These are my fire agates. Have we got some carrot weights there, honey bun? Because I haven't got my um, details, beautiful. It's called Step in Time. And I've got my lovely nuggets here. Look at these, these are beautiful. Um, fire agate irregular faceted rice beads, up to 31 millimetres, 910 carats. Then we've got my Chinese quartzite, my green jade there, my Chinese jade quartzite, 90 carats in the six millimetre rounds. And then my black onyx nuggets, 150 carats. And actually this is important because can you see the beading thread? It's gold coloured because the, the findings are silver in this kit with gold plating. With gold plating. So two gold plated silver bolt ring clasps in the jump rings. 10 gold plated sterling silver head pins. They're four centimeters long. Two pairs of gold plated sterling silver shepherd hooks. 10 gold plated silver crimp beads. And look at the added bonus. This is ridiculous. 10 gold plated sterling silver four millimeter balls. Are you sure about this young lady? Hmm? Any donut deliveries for you today? Ah, oh, rubbish. Rubbish. I've got, a, I've got a digestive I can give you, chocolate covered. You've got a little, you've come prepared today. All righty, with all of that, so, you know, goal, if you're happy at 19.95 for this sensational kit called Step in Time, and do you know what? Fee's secret package would look fantastic with this. 17.95. Well done, Marion's won one, but I'm gonna give another one away to the person that can text in. What is the, in, what is the other strand in Fee's secret package? Yeah. So keep your texts coming. Let me know as well what you've made with our DVDs. Let me know, actually, if you've got this kit. What did you make with it? Are you buying another one? $17.95. I love it because now I've got... And I've got those balls in there because you've seen our fundamentals of the gold plate, of the silver findings. So we have all of that plus it's gold plated. Plus I've got 10 of those little plain four millimetre balls, which are great for spaces and, you know, just judging up. Hello, Adam. Adam always gets out his smoky quartz for me. It's about 266 carats. Is it 366 carats? It's a beautiful pear shape. He, pe he bought it for 50 pounds and it was valued at 245 pounds. He bought it from Gem Collector. There he is wandering around with a cup of coffee. Isn't that amazing? That's just going to show you. <laughs> when we sell our pieces here, whether it be Gems TV, Gem Collector, Jewelry Maker, um, we're all one family under the same umbrella. It's not the value or the worth of the gemstones. I met a lady here doing the... Now, let me just check. It was the day after the Academy. It was a Friday. It was a silver clay course with Natalia. 
She had on a ring I bought from Gems TV. It must be six years ago, identical. So it was the same one. Mine was yellow gold, hers was white gold. And my sister loved it so much, I had to get my sister one. The yellow gold had sold out, so I got her the white gold version. I never got it valued, she did. Now we paid about, around about 100 pounds for it. It was a beautiful, you know, you know I get on my high horse about black spinel. It was black, big black spinel with white sapphires. So we paid about three figures, 100 pounds or 125 pounds. Her name was Irene. Hello, Irene, if you're watching. Do you wanna know what the valuation was? £1,045 six years ago. Goodbye. I texted my sister and she says, I'm too afraid to wear it now. So she, that's what it's for wearing, isn't it? Can you imagine what it might be worth now? I mean, I just bought it because I loved it. Yeah, rambling again, aren't I? But, you know, it's not the worth of the value. It's not the worth of the value, but it just goes to show you the savings we can bring you. Big box. Red and fancy Jasper. Now... Oh, yeah. I'm going to bring you another bead box. A reduccio on the bead box. Nice to see you, Adam. How are the twins? They're very well, thank ah, you. Grown up fast, you girls. Mm. Got two beautiful little girls. How old are they now, Adam? 14 months. 14 months. Gosh, I don't know how you cope with two, let alone one. I can't cope with one. Right, this incredible box used to be 21.95. But you are beautiful. You're gorgeous. You're keeping us company today with all your texts. And so we are not going to stay there. Now, let me take you through what you're getting in our red and fancy Jasper six strand V box. We've got our red Jasper eight millimeter plain rounds. I can't quite see the carrot weight, darling. It's gone off the screen. If you could just tell me in my ear, I'll read it out. That's oh, all right, darling. All it says, eight mils. The red jasper. I'll start with the nuggets then. Yeah, which yeah. Uh, carrot weight, darling. That's all right, love. 180. I'll go to the nuggets. 230. I'll go to the big, large, elongated nugget. 400. I'm now going to the jasper, uh, beautiful rice beads, 10 by 8. 250. Uh, then going to go to the regular sort of long nuggety columns. 290 carats, 12 by uh, 200 carats, sorry, 12 by 8 millimeters. And then, oh, these are 200, the buttons, and they're 290. 290 carats, 200. We got there in the end. It was a bit of a jumble, but uh, plus your sturdy. Basically, we get the idea. It's a big carrot weight. <laughs> we love those colors, those earthy red terracotta tones. I, I, I quite understand. I quite understand, my darling. And then our lovely, lovely russety greens. Look at that price. Six strands at 14.95. I'm trying to do the maths. Two pounds 30 a strand. 249 a strand. Two pounds 49 a strand. Instead of, you know, what would have been as little as three pounds 66, which was great. And you've got all of those beautiful gemstones, jasper, and in the colour of the greens and the reds, and then your terracotta brick jasper as well. So we can make the jewellery, we can um, add to kits, we can just increase our store. You know, often I have new jewellery makers purchase, they, they like the, the offers, the bargains, the gems, and then they sit back and then they watch for the weekend and then decide to make something. So it needn't even be right now, just, but just don't miss out. Because as far as I'm concerned, Jewelry Maker is a one-stop shop, the most competitive in terms of the price points. You know what you're getting, and we're here to help. We're here to encourage you to make this uh, jewelry. And also, it's a lovely gift idea as well. Sometimes people buy the bead boxes plus a findings pack. You get your DVD and your booklet, uh, and they think of it as a gift idea. Now, we may have had another winner in Feast Competition. We had, what was the first lady's name? Marion from, from uh, Canvey Island. She sent in her ID number. You've definitely got uh, one of F Fee's packages. <laughs> no, 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 that's fine. I'm going to announce it after this. I won't go, don't go anywhere. We've got our second winner who's going to receive Fee's secret package absolutely free. Uh, but you know what? Actually, I'm going to announce it in a minute because I want to do it in a minute. Don't go anywhere because for the rest of you, it's a fantastic price point.
into your collection with our Sculpey Clay Projects DVD, full of handy tips and hints for all levels. Join guest designer Debbie Bulford as she teaches us how to create the Skinner Blend technique, how to use the extruder tool, how to make a three-part necklace and much more. To get your hands on a copy, phone our call centre now on 0800 644 655. Want to advance your polymer clay techniques? Then why not come and join us on our new Millie Fiori course? Join guest designer Debbie Bulford as she guides you through numerous techniques for creating flowers and leaves, from simple daisy canes to elaborate floral pieces. If you're looking to create unique handmade jewellery, then this is the course for you. During the course of the day, you'll get to have a backstage tour of the studios, meet the presenters and take a trip to our jewellery shop. The full course includes black and white clay, a colour clay pack of your choice, use of all tools, a buffet style lunch and refreshments, and all for just $67.95. For details on course dates and availability, contact our call centre now on 0800 644 655. Jewellery Maker, bringing out the designer in you. Jewelry Maker are proud to present our new range of Lisa Pavelka crafting foils. These easy to use foils are a great way to create a unique look to your polymer and silver clay designs. With a wide range of vibrant colours including gold, silver and rainbow, these foils will leave your creations with a wonderful metallic coating. Use alongside our border moulds and textured stamps to add a different dimension to your clay creation. To view our full range of Lisa Pavelka products, visit our website. Adam is there, Palais in la Francais. Give me a countdown in French. You in German? Ja. <laughs> Eins, zwei, drei, vier, fünf, sechs. Uh, righty ho, we've got pumpkin seeds. Now it's already low in stock. It's already low in stock. It is our uh, second new jewellery kit. We we're asking you to text in which of these you'd like our gorgeous guest designer, uh, Lucy, to demonstrate. But uh, let's take you through the kit again so you can uh, get involved. Here it is. It's Fee's favourite. Low stock, low stock, low stock. Uh, so we do need to act quickly, but here we go. It's going like hotcakes. We've got Fee's favourite, which I'm so pleased about because I'm, I'm here to revolutionise the jewellery making world and make everybody get involved with Botswana Agate. 280 carats of the medium nuggets, 260 carats of the citrine, which is so bright and vibrant, uh, 70 carats of that magical mystic quartz. Oh, so pretty. You're so pretty. Um, then all your silver, then all your beading materials as well. Monofilament, elastic, beading thread, large and small gift bag, two pairs of shepherd hooks, 10 head pins, 10 crimp beads, three sterling silver bolt ring class in the jump rings, 21.95. 21.95, that's why we're low stock because we did launch it earlier, but we want to give everybody time to come on in and we had lots of texts, but just to show one of them, this was the overriding um, consensus if you like. Uh, but I'll just show you the jewellery again. We had, this is what you can make out of the kit. That was necklace number two. There were these beautiful earrings, which were number one. Beautiful earrings number three. Just an example of what you can make, and we'll go and see Lucy in a moment. Bracelet, nice and simple, number four. But the consensus is you all want to see what Gemma's wearing. The fantastic necklace, which actually... Um, incorporates all of the gemstones in the kit. So this is what we're going to demonstrate. That was, have we got that text? Just one of the texts there, darling. You said you were going to show one. Yeah, this is from June in Cumbria. You're amongst many people. She says, June in Carlisle, I'd like to see number five. I've made flowers 
and a long necklace using the wire work. Oh yes, because I was asking what else you've done in terms of the DVDs, what have you made from the DVDs? So she said she's uh, made flowers and long necklaces using the wire work and the gizmo DVDs in the same piece as the techniques in, and they both complement each other. Yeah, so that is fantastic. Shall we put her here so we can see the necklace? Beautiful. So June and everybody else, thank you for your text. Nice to see that, you know, you've been working with the DVDs as well and using the techniques. And uh, thank you for your text because you've all decided, well, the majority of voters what we've gone with and uh, you want to see this beautiful necklace technique that Lucy has created out of the pumpkin seed kit. So beautiful. I like the fact that in this necklace, Lucy, you've used all the gemstones. This is beautiful, well, isn't it? Well, they work so well together. Yeah. Just to mix them up. That is beautiful, isn't it? And then I've just gone for simple stranding around the, around the neck. Yeah. Because you've got that feature pendant. Yeah. And that's nice because, you know, there isn't a pendant in the kit, but you, you, you've, met, you've made one, basically, haven't yeah. you? Yeah. All I've done is I've picked out the largest one of the citrine and then surrounded it by the mystic quartz, oh. which is definitely my favourite, I think. Yeah. Very effective. Show me how to do it, my darling. Okay, then. Okay, so we take a length of wire. Always go for lots, because it's better to have too much than too little, and we are going to be going round in circles a couple of times. So right, okay. <laughs> it's enough. better to have too much, and then you can trim it back. Okay. So all we're, all we're doing is you, you pick your citrine that you're going to use as your focal bead, and then you need to kind of measure around it with your mystic quartz to see kind of how many you're going to need. Yeah. So I've just placed them around like so, so you get an idea of how many you're going to need. Okay, which happens to be 12, I think that is, for this particular one. So we start off with our centre bead. You thread that on. You go down to the middle of your wire so you've got plenty to go with. And on half of the beads, so one side of it. So that'll be six in this case. So we just simply thread them on. Because the um, citrines, you know, they've all got that different sizing because they're natural. I mean, you've picked one of the biggest there in the strand. So yes. that's, I suppose, you know, like you said, you measure how many of those lovely mystic quartz you're going to need. That's why that, you yeah. need to measure it, yes, because yeah. they'll all be different and you just have to see what you get, really. Or you could use um, something from your stash if you wanted yeah. to use something else in the centre. Because your remit is thing. only to use what's in the kit, isn't yeah. it? But we've all got a stash, we can add extra. That was, that was one thing that I was a little upset with this, this kit. I really, oh, yeah. really wanted to add some of that um, purpley coloured druzy that I've oh. got. It would go absolutely beautiful. With that orange mystique? Yeah. Oh, I was dying word. to do it. I was like, I can't. No, the rules are the rules. <laughs> but you at home can. That's, that yes, sounds like at home, a if you've got idea. it, it would work really well. Mmm, liking that. OK, so if you wrap your wire around the side, you'll see that it, it covers half of yes. the, set, the focal bo yeah. bead. Sorry. And then we're going to pass that wire down through the bead, the central bead. Doing it this way, it just means it's going to stay in place better because you could go all the way around. Yes. But then it would it, it yeah, move about a lot. It's anchoring more. it, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. That's so, a good idea, actually. So we're just taking it back down through the centre. So you've got half. Uh huh. Then we'll add on the other half. Mm -hmm. So you thread on your other six, or however many you've got. And do the same thing. Can't see it for the mystic coating. <laughs> it's a, yeah, it's shining. so sparkly, isn't it? So it makes it so beautiful, though. It gives it all those different colours that yeah. dance off it. Yeah, you get rainbow pinks and then blues and greens, and it's just even better in the flesh, isn't it? It is. You've definitely got to get it up close. Yeah. Have a good look. So you wrap that around the other side, like so. And again, we're going to be passing it through that oh, central down, bead again. Right, down and through again, yeah. So you just 
pass it through. I mean, the, the holes are, are nice and big through this, the citrine, so yeah. we can go through several times, it's fine. So you put it tight, you start to see it form. Yes. Now to keep it nice and, and solid, to yeah. give it that structure, I'm going to pass the wire all the way around the loop. So you go ah, back through. Right, so you've got to thread through back every single gem. Yeah, which gotcha. is why you want to have an excess of wire. Because it really is firm, your design, you know, in terms of how it sits and... Yeah. Yeah. You need to give it that strength. Mm -hmm. Otherwise it'll just move about a lot. Because I suppose essentially after you've done that, it is just threading, isn't it? it yeah. Yeah. It's just going round a few times, that's all. Mm. How many times would you take it round again, Luce? Probably twice. Probably twice, yeah. But you'll, you'll see, as soon as you start doing it, mm -hmm. um, you'll realise when it's strong enough to, to hold it in shape. Yeah. OK, obviously they'll, they'll move about whilst you're doing it to start with. It'll come loose, you just have to then pull your wires tighter and, and so. But we're going all the way around. So that it links those two halves together. Yeah. So you've done your one half and you keep going around the other the second half. You can do it in stages. Yeah, I can see you thread through a few at a time. It's, yeah. You've got a, you've got a little kink at your end there. Yeah, I have. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes you can get it all in one go, mm -hmm. but sometimes you have to just do a couple at a time. And just keep threading it around the loop. Try not to kink it too much. <laughs> we can snip off our kink. You see, that's why you start with you such could, success, yeah. isn't it? Anyway. And the aim then will be to have the two wires at one end, so you can then carry on and do the rest of your necklace. So you see it's coming loose there, so I just need to tighten everything up. So you see this, this wire has now come out at the top. Yep. This one. Mm -hmm. And this one's still at the bottom. So what I would do is to use the other side and go in the opposite direction oh, so it comes out. To bring them to meet them up at yeah. the same place. And then you've finished it, am I right, with another mystic right at the top there to, to bring yes. it all together? Yeah, if you just put one at the, at the top, it gives it a bit of space and then you can yeah. lead off and just do some simple stranding. And then each one goes either way. It. And you've gone Botswana, Citrine, citrine, Botswana, Mystic. Citrine. I mean, did you pick your Botswanas randomly or were you going for similar colour tones either side? Or was uh, it, just... it was pretty much random yeah. with those. And then uh, I've just used uh, the Mystic Quartz yeah. together occasionally. Yeah, and, and one little quartz there, depending on how you want to go in your design. So, But you could literally three. do any kind of combination you like. You could do it all of one, all Citrine, all yeah. Botswana agate. And that is simple stranding on and finishing with your crimp and your bolt ring, which again is a demonstration on our DVD, which you get for free. Yes. And we often demonstrate, I mean, we demonstrated that Thursday as well, so. Lovely. So Thank you, yeah. 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 Beautiful, absolutely fantastic. So June in Cumbria and everybody else who texted in, thank you very much, Elizabeth and uh, Mary and Sally. Thank you, because uh, that, it was, we went with the consensus of what you wanted to see in terms of the demonstrations. All righty. The others are, are fairly simple yeah, techniques as, yeah, as I mean, well. The quadrant is... one, uh, I'm sure you've probably seen. If you haven't seen it before, then um, it will be on the, the DVDs and things. Um, then on the, the earrings in front here, that's just a head pin with um, a paler version of the Botswana Agate. I've tried to pick two that are similar. Mm -hmm. And then I've used another head pin, just created a spiral by wrapping it around. Very around effective, those that. Yeah, I like that. So that it hangs around the central. It's making more of the silver, isn't it, in yeah. the kit? Yeah. Well, silver's so so much value, isn't it? Yeah, so exactly. It's, it's good to show it off rather than hiding it all the time. Exactly, make a feature of it. And again, simple threading on the bracelet. And I love yeah. this because Botswana is so beautiful <laughs> and it's got such different colours in there and patterns that well, sometimes exactly. just, you don't need to no, make it fancy. No, because it, it's the gem does it enough. itself. So that's simple threading through and finishing with your bolt ring in your kit. And then because those mystics are so pretty as well. I had free to do some just on their own, yes. Yeah, why not? <laughs> they sparkle really well. Why not? <laughs> Lovely for an evening out. So five beautiful designs.
Um, so there you have it. Uh, it was going like hot cakes. It's our second new kit of the day, twenty-one ninety-five. The Mystic Quartz, the Botswana, and the God, the, the light and the luminosity on that citrine is beautiful and uh, a lovely sunny piece there for the summer. Right, we've been inspired by Lucy Designs. I hope you have as well, but I'm going to have a little look at some of your designs now on this week's Wall of Fame. <laughs> Now this is where you can win £100 worth of credit or 50 every Wednesday to spend with Jewellery Maker. If we choose your design out of the hat, we assign you a number and it's literally like a tombola. It literally gets picked out of the hat. And all you've got to do is email or send in your designs to uh, studio at jewelrymaker.com and we'll give you the postal address as well. It's in our hub magazine that we send you as well. Um, and we love looking at your designs and... <gasps> Wow. Beautiful, isn't it? Like a beautiful rosary. This is gorgeous. So, number 48 is Lynn, who says, Hi all at JM. My entry for this week's Wall of Fame is a rosary made using mookite and magnesite with gold-plated wire, all from JM. Wow, Lynn, That's I've never Lynn. seen a beautiful rosary like that made out of the, uh, the jewellery maker techniques. That is fantastic. What a lovely gift for a Holy Communion or a, or a christening or a, uh, a confirmation, because I've still got my rosaries from when, you know, when I've made Holy Communion and that. And yeah. Confirmation. You just keep them, don't yeah, you? Yeah, you would. That's just so beautiful. <laughs> just gorgeous. How lovely. How lovely. Um, this is number 50. And uh, love the colour punch. <laughs> yeah. You see a lot of purple and the reds, don't you, yes. at the moment? Uh, this is from Melanie in Essex. And she's used coral and purple agate from the winter, or oh, remember the winterberry kit, and some purple jade from a three strand pack, mixing it up there. She's a really pleased with the result, hope you like it. She's totally addicted, even though she's only been making jewelry for a couple of months. And uh, she must feed her habit, which means she's thinking about attempting to sell some of her jewelry, but she can't bear to part with any of the pretties. She says, let's hope I'm lucky with the, uh, the Wall of Fame and the Wednesday prize draw so that it will solve the problem temporarily. She just loves the channels and all the presenters and the designers and the way we have a laugh and we don't take ourselves too seriously. Keep it up and look forward to making her next purchase. Well, Melanie from Essex, I know it's, it's hard, isn't it? If you're thinking, if I sell it, I can buy more. But I yeah. like it, so I don't want to sell it. That's always the best way, though. If you you make something that you you like yourself, something yeah. you would buy, then somebody else will. So it's a good sign. It, it is a good sign. <laughs> Just yes, yeah, somehow we need to sell it and then be able to make some for ourselves, but still make a profit so we can still get yes. some more. That's well, the problem like, solved. You can do that with the kits. Is yeah, you can. To, you to can. make lots. So yeah, exactly. Keep them for yourself and sell them. Exactly. Make two of everything. That's the way forward. <laughs> oh, okay. lovely Next wire up, work. Some lovely wire work. Mm. It's number forty nine. And it's Carol in Edinburgh, who says, Hi to everyone at Jewelry Maker. Please find my Wall of Fame entry for this week. This is my first attempt at some wire work. I felt inspired after watching your show and just had to try it out. I used two of your large blue agate slabs. They really are mahoosive. Mahoosive! <laughs> blue jade rounds, lapis lazuli chips, blue and green beading thread, all from JM, and a couple of white quartz nuggets from my stash. I've used one of JM's blue ribbons, from your ribbon bundle to attach the pendant. Anyway, the DPD man will bring some more goodies today, including some lovely coloured wire, so I'll be keeping busy. Ah. Keep up the great work and all the new ideas. Hugs to all, and that's Carol Edinburgh. Ah, oh, Carol. As a first attempt at the, the wire know. work, that's really neat. Amazing. <laughs> Amazing, Carol. Can have fun with the, the stuff that's arriving now. Yeah, I know, definitely. Um, this is exquisite, and this is number 51. And this is another lady in Edinburgh, this is from Ruth. And she says, I've had the Kunzite for quite a while, but couldn't think of what to do with it until I got this Labradorite. So I've used um, the pearl strands, because I've always got plenty of those in my stash. And she says, although I usually go for bold designs, the gems just seem to work as a very simple necklace. And Ruth, I have to agree, because the Kunzite with the pearl and then those petal-shaped labradorites. It's just so elegant. And what a beautiful piece of jewellery. Gorgeous. So that's Ruth at Edinburgh. Ruth, for Wednesday's prize draw, we've assigned you number 51. Now, I had a bit of a competition earlier. Uh, Marion in Canvey Island. 
uh, guessed one of my strands in the pack. I didn't say whether there's one or several, but I was being cheeky with it. So uh, Marion uh, got one for free, but there was another strand in there. And I'm going to send these to Marion and Donna in Kent, because you were the first to guess it right, because it's the first text that I get with it right. It is, I mean, we've had some since, but I did say the first text. Um, I'm going to give you this absolutely free Donna in Kent. I can't show you text because obviously it's got your customer number. But she says, maybe it's Jasper and Aventurine. And yes, you're right, Donna. But we're all going to be a winner today because I'm not just going to give this to Marion and Donna for being the first people to text in as to what was in my secret Fifi pack. But we've got an absolute demon price for you. So, Luce, give me a price. What do you think? What would you think by jewelry maker standards we would sell this at? In all honesty, if you uh, you know being here with me every day and maybe seventeen. Seventeen? No, go lower. Fourteen. Fourteen? No. Let's show you actually where we've no. sold. Yeah, but loose. I'm not stopping there. What? Do you want to give me another price? Seven ninety-five. We're going to give it away. Lucy's right. We're not stopping at 9.95. No one's ever seen these three go so low because I wanted you all to be winners, not just our lovely Donna in Kent and Marion in Canvey Island. 7.95 for, for those of you. Strands. I, know. <laughs> I know. And wouldn't that, can you see why I said perhaps with those oranges, yeah. you know, and the citrines, how it looked nice in that second kit? It would. Beautiful. And, and with that, um, the toffee the orange pie. Oh yes, it? do yeah. you remember coffee, the, toffee no, whatever pie, whatever? Yeah, those those big jaspers, those big caramel jaspers, and that had the red yeah. adventurine in it. Or your challenge today with your jasper wonderstone, yeah, because you've got these lovely, and that's like the peaches you see in that uh, wonderstone. So, yeah, you know that lovely big old strand, um, <laughs> big old strand that Lucy's working with today. This would be beautiful. So set, no one's ever, seen, not even on the Late Show, no one's seen these three go so low. This is only for you today because I wanted you all to be winners. And thank you for all your texts. But the first people to get it right were Donna and Marion. Just a bit of fun. Fee's, Fee's secret package. I'll try and do another one tomorrow. Secret package. I'll do another <laughs> one tomorrow. Woo! Can I just say the Bentley in the car park is not mine. <laughs> Whoever visited the studio on Friday and texted in and said, Ian, Ian, did you... As if I've got the money to drive a Bentley. Uh, no, it's a boring Ford Focus, I'm afraid. <laughs> I'd love a Bentley. Now, do you know what? I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I, if, I, if I had the money, I'd have a Jag. Yeah, that's I fair really enough. would. Fair enough. <laughs> I'd, have an, I'd have a... You'd have an Asti. What would you have? What, oh, I don't really know. No. I, I'm not big on cars, if I'm honest. <laughs> They're a functional thing for me. I'm not big on what it is or what it does. As long as it's cost as as effective. It goes. <laughs> exactly. But if I could, ideally, I would go for a Jag. I know, I, perhaps a bit boring, but it's what Isn't I like. nice to drive. It's, yeah, exactly. Yeah. And it's, you know, there's so many beautiful different varieties. Aesthetically, to me, I just think they look beautiful. There we go. What would you have, Adam? I'd have a Lamborghini. A Lamborghini. Oh! Showy. <laughs> showy, 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 showy. <laughs> Um, here we go, it was Ian and he says, last Friday, I dropped my wife off at Jewelry Maker. She was attending the Silver Clay Court outside the entrance, was parked a big Bentley. And I knew it had to be... <laughs> <laughs> oh, you are kidding me, Ian. You know whose car that is? The boss. The boss man. You only have to look at the, the, the registration to know that. But anyway, that's another story. Uh, he's away. He's in Tanzania. He's at Mount Kilimanjaro as I speak. Uh, so, uh, Ian, uh, in my... I'm hoping there's a <laughs> sense of irony in that text. You know, the fact that I'd be... Actually, if I could afford a Bentley, I'd have a chauffeur driving me. I was going to say, definitely have one. Wouldn't drive at all. <laughs> Adam's going to drive. You'll be my chauffeur. I love being driven. It's because I do so much driving. If somebody else wants to take over the wheel, oh, I'm in heaven. A little cap. It's going into Fantasy fantasy land now, yeah. isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh, we've got loads coming up. More late shoe. No, late, late shoes. shoes. <laughs> late show review redos. Uh, review redos. And last chance bead boxes. And our third new kit. Should we have a little look? Our third new kit. I'm wearing a couple of beautiful pieces here that the lady beside me has made. Yeah, from our third new kit today. And don't forget, they're all coming in at under £25. So don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after this.
The Jury Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jury designer. And each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their Jury Maker account, and the runner up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jurymaker.com or you can post your photos to Wall of Fame, Coloured Rocks Limited, Unit 2D, Eagle Road, Moons Moat, Redditch, B989HF. Good luck and happy jury making. Add to your collection with our Macrame and Notting DVD, which is full of hints and tips and step-by-step -step instructions for all levels. Join guest designers Laura Liggy and Debbie Bulford as they take you through how to create half-hitch knots, square knots and many more. To get your hands on a copy, phone our call centre on 0800 644 655. Jewelry Maker, bringing out the designer in you. Well, here at Jewelry Maker, we have absolutely everything that the experienced Jewelry Maker requires. We also have absolutely everything that a beginner would require. But for the more experienced Jewelry Maker who has probably encouraged their own creativity, perhaps by buying the kits in the first place, they then move on and, and become able to look at the gemstone uh, strands that we carry and the findings and almost make up their own kits, their custom-made kits and then they're able to put together a beautiful piece of jewellery, possibly that they've even seen in, in, a, in a store in the high street or something, but put it together themselves and there's nothing more rewarding than doing just that. You can now keep in touch by liking Jewellery Maker UK on Facebook. Get interactive with Jewellery Maker. Famed for their openness of colour, our Hunan Peridot gemstones are sought after for their bright greens and graceful golden undertones. Brought to life by their dazzling brilliance, we are able to bring out the pure hues, the fire and the sheer brilliance of this gem. We only source raw crystals with the potential to show off all of these remarkable qualities. For a gem full of sparkling bright greens and glorious golden tones, look no further than our Chinese Hunan Peridot. Hi, welcome back. Don't forget my magical midday madness with this three strand pack of Amazonite and turquoise. Beautiful quality. I'm going to do this at midday, so make sure you're watching. Uh, we've taken a good eight pounds off the launch price because I really wanted you to know that we, we want as many people as possible to take advantage of this incredible offer. Beautiful, natural, all those spearmint, those high, beautiful quality Amazonites and the rice beads and the uh, puffy ovals and then that gorgeous, gorgeous turquoise. So that's my midday madness. Um, I've got my third new kit to launch as well. Will that be asking you what you want to see? I've got the second strand of the Blue Appetite uh, coloured jasper. I've still got my Hypish theme. Got some lovely silver pearls to launch. But first, let's revisit a late show review. That was Redood. Reduction. A review, Redood. It's only been on once. It's only been on once. It's called Fly Higher. Fly Higher. Now, look at these. There you go, Tommy. Uh, 480 carats. Now, this kit used to be £29. 21, 29 95 It then went to, I don't know what was going on, 21 95 Also, it must have been on more than once. I'll give up. And then we've got 90 carats of black agate faceted rondelles. So these are great staples. Look at this sparkle. These will look fantastic with our third kit. And then four... 100, oh, that's 480, 90, and then 40 carats of our black agate 
stripe. So you see some whites in there of the faceted four millimetre rounds. So 480, 40, 90. So it's called Fly Higher. All the silver is in there as well, the fundamentals of this. Now these are three great staples to use, if not together, at some point in your jewellery making. It was 29.95, was 21.95, limited stock. It's a late show review, redo. 50 metres of beading thread and monofilament and elastic and gift bags. So new jewellery makers, you know, don't forget free DVD and booklet with your first ever purchase. You can start with these coins, all the silver in the kit, and we'll enable you to, uh, you know, make jewellery even further. Got more demonstrations from Lucy coming up as well. Here comes the prize. $17.95, under $18. Pounds. Bargain. I know. It's literally £12 off the original launch price. But the reason we've reduced it is because we're revisiting uh, the, the stock. There's limited availability, obviously, because it's already been launched. But we're clearing out, you know, there's no good having 40 of these left. Uh, and, you know, because we've got to make room for more to come in, basically. Simple as. It was a review, a late show redo review on the late show. So, and I, we just thought, what a winner, especially with the black and white kits that we've seen and, you know, using those, those three very different sh uh, sizes and shapes there, rondelles, large rounds, little, medium, smaller. You can do beady beading with those, the four millimeter banded agate. Just gorgeous. I just think they look so magical. And uh, you could mix this up with our third new kit today, or even the first new kit, Asteroid. They look beautiful with it. Limited stock though, because I know a lot of you love those big black staple gemstones. What's that, darling? I, we've got, you know, it's like any kit. We don't tend to bring them back again. We try sometimes when you ask, and you know, they've proved a big popular hit, but you know, it's about combining different colors, different gem types. It's also about what we can get hold of, you know, what's available on the gem market. What can we actually, what's available in the gem mines? What's that at an affordable price? Because if something's really, really popular and sells out, the demand for pieces goes up, prices go up, so it's not always something we can source. Proven very popular, 17.95, no guarantee we're ever gonna see it again. So once the stock's gone, that's it, all been allocated. And that luster is incredible. Incredible. Beautiful. If I just pick up, you know, look at, our, I've been wearing this bracelet. Our second new kit, of the third new kit of the day. Look how they tie in beautifully with it. That's because I'm going to ask you again to text in which design when I launch it you want to see. Alrighty, well done everybody. I'm going to launch a new strand. I mentioned I had some dog tooth amethyst and here it is. Here it is. Love dog tooth amethyst because it's not just um, the, 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 the purples that you get. You get these lovely silvery and mild whites as well. I always think this looks pretty with labradorite, you know. Diane, the lady had mixed it with kunzite and labradorite. A beautiful uh, gem mix. Well, this is this is pretty with labradorite as well. Pretty with obviously a rich dark toned purple amethyst. Pretty with the pinks, milky white plus the amethyst quartz there. Very distinctive banding. Very di distinctive sort of mottle patterns and shapes. Just very distinctive. Beautiful. Brand new, the dog tooth amethyst. Now I'm already starting with limited availability. So that suggests to me I'm already starting for this brand new strand uh, with double figures. I'm starting with double figures. Mm -hmm. 240 carats. Any of the other dog tooth amethysts that we've shown has always sold out. So I'm not even sure if we've got any, have we got any on the web, uh, Karen? I'm not even sure actually. If there's anything else available, even on our own website. But right now, this is available. It's coming at you at a fantastic price. All right. Eight pounds 45. There you go. For that fantastic dog tooth amethyst with the whites and the silvers in there and the amethyst quartz and the milky white opaqueness. Sorry. No, I don't, I don't think there's anything on the website. They're available in terms of the dog tooth amethyst. Yeah, I think it's basically, when we've launched it, been an absolute sellout success. Uh, there's none available to launch there on the web. 
So it's gone on the live show and sold out. So get into low stock, low stock, low stock. Started with limited stock, down to low stock. Beautiful. Beautiful. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Should we do another last chance speed box? Because that's what it says behind me. Let's do it. Um, now, just checking what I'm doing. There we go. I love this. I put three of these strands with that second new kit as well. Pumpkin seeds. And these remind me of fish. Well, it did when it sat like that, but now that I can see it flatter, it doesn't remind me of fish. Um, I'll show you what I mean. This is uh, beautiful because you've got the coral reds, these silver dove greys, and these whites in the Matrix Jaff Jas Jaffa in the Matrix Jasper puffy ovals. Um, these are 250 carats, 25 by 18 millimeters. 24.95 originally this six strand bead box, but I've also got my Zebra Jasper puffy squares, two centimeters by 50. Mm -hmm. Zebra, zebra. Um, I've also got my rice speed shaped red matrix jasper. That would look nice with that um, zebra jasper we did this morning. Do you remember the late show redo redo? Um, then we've got my puffy ovals in the uh, zebra jasper small 170 carats. Then we've got the round coins of the Jasper, the red matrix, 18 millimeters across, 270 carats. And then, and this is the one I thought looked like a fish until I got it out. Um, my zebra Jasper waved rectangles, 38 by 16 millimeters, 380 carats. It's cause he was like that. Can you see when it's like that, look fishy like shaped. Cause I couldn't, I couldn't see the bit there. No, it's just me then. When he was lying in the box, they're such a fabulous labradorite pearls. Pretty. They're such an unusual shape, aren't they? Coral, the coppers of that, you know, the oranges actually of uh, my, my giveaway earlier for secret package. Uh, the, the early bird as well. Do you remember those uh, copper and, and mink colored sort of blonde pearls? Oh yes, the dog tooth Jasper that I've just had, of course. No, the dog tooth amethyst, sorry. I'd like that, actually, if I put those with the, the silvery greys, the larger ovals there. I like those two together, what do you think? And maybe a, a, some darker rondelles of the amethyst that I had on Thursday. Beautiful. There it is at the bottom of the screen, my dog tooth amethyst, but for Six strand BD box plus your sturdy plastic box as well. Ten pounds off the original price, fourteen ninety five. We're your one stop shop. Everything you need is here: the tools, the tutorials, the DVDs, the gemstones, the threading materials, the techniques, the help, free phone number, thirty day money back guarantee. Beautiful. All righty, don't forget my Midday Madness with the Amazonite and the Turquoise. Don't forget, actually, um, the Hypers theme would look lovely with these silvery greys. If I just um, take out those and just show you the Hypers theme, because they're like a parcel shape, but they have this wonderful shiller. Let me just show you those. So very different properties. They look nice as well. They're almost heating up, but they're different. So my Hypers theme is still to come. And the second of the Appetite Jasper coloured strands. Let's launch my third new kit of the day, simply to give you time to choose your technique, uh, because I prefer if you chose it, in terms of what you would like Lucy to demonstrate. Now she's made one, two, three, four, five, six pieces of beautiful jewelry, some of which I've been wearing all day. The bracelets, the earrings, and it's called Frosty Stone because you can see why. It's those big white quartz frosted nuggets, 610 carats, and they, they glow. There is a wonderful illumination in them. They really, they really glow. Beautiful and set against the black, the black backdrop. Really crisp, 
you could put a lovely bit of color in there and it would almost imbue the, the quartz, it would flavor it, if you like, with the color, maybe the pinks or the reds. Then you've got 90 carats of the six millimeter black agate plain rounds. That was the bracelet you saw me wearing. So a lovely, sharp, clean, crisp contrast. And then 30 carats of the black veined jasper plain rounds. So the grays and the blacks in that six strand bead box would work beautifully in fusion with the frosty stone kit. So three very different gem types, styles, cuts, shapes, in terms of size anyway, two of the rounds there. We've got all the silver. It's our third new kit of the day. We were guaranteeing all three of them under 25 pounds. You've got your silver head pins, two sterling silver shepherd hook pairs, three bolt ring clasp with your jump rings, 10 crimp beads, beading thread, elastic monofilament, large and small gift bag. Now, this is a great starter kit. A great starter kit. Because, you know, we've got some very simple designs, more intricate designs that we can show. So, six pieces of jewellery made out of this kit. Remember, as Lucy said earlier, silver jewellery. Silver jewellery, because there's silver findings in there. Brand new today, a great starter kit, because not only the gemstones, the price point, 1995, our most affordable kit of the day. Our most affordable kit of the day, at under 20 pounds. And there's 610 carats of those white quartz frosty nuggets. They're huge. They're like big ice cubes. Frosty, crisp, clean. And then the beautiful rounds to work with as well. Under 20 pounds. So you've got the very demure, you've got the very substantial. It's whether you want to go down the chunky. Actually, the designs are very elegant and I think it is because of the mix of having the smaller, beautiful, demure rounds. And yes, we've got the big chunkies, but they don't look like lumpy designs because um, Lucy's given it a very elegant touch with the way in which she's mixed these together. And I think you need that. Because if we had three big chunky strands, it would just be chunk, chunktastic, wouldn't it? It would just be too much, wouldn't it? You need to draw it back. You need something to contrast, don't you? Yeah. That's what we need. Shall we show you the designs? Let's, they're all labeled. Jack has come up with numbers now. Now this is the bracelet you saw me wearing. I love this bracelet. If you never see it again, you know why. I love it. I absolutely love this. And that is beautiful. So we can demonstrate how to make that beautiful bracelet. Text me in, it's number one. It's almost glowing. I love the way it kept catching the light in the studio. So I'd like you to text us in. I'll get the text message and service up at the end, but just look at the designs. You choose and we'll go with the consensus. We'll go with the majority vote. And I was also wearing number two. Do you know what? I could show you how to make that myself. That's a nice simple one for Fee. That's a stretchy. I'm not, don't get me wrong, I'm not knocking stretchies because I love stretchies. But in terms of, I think we need to push Lucy a bit more. Uh, that's me. I think she could just do that on the back of another demonstration, quite frankly. Because there is some hot tips to do. It, is, it sounds silly, but it is in the knot tying, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> laughing at me now. This is number three, my beautiful earrings that I was wearing. Probably couldn't see because I'm a big barnet, but there you go. Number three, number three. Okay, they're lovely, they are. See what I mean about the elegance now? Look at these. Uh, number four, another pair of earrings. Beautiful uh, head pin wrapping there. I have absolutely no idea how she got that to perfectly fit around the gem. Maybe she, maybe she actually did just wrap around that gem. But they just seem to sit coiled perfectly. We'll ask her anyway. Uh, demonstration could be number five. Lovely bit of weave work here. These are so, can you see what I mean about it not being all like a big chunky chunkiness? These beautiful, elegant little flowers there in between those large quartzes. So if you'd like to see us demonstrate number five, text us in. Or alternatively, Gemma has got on necklace number six. So these are six pieces that Lucy made out of the kit. We'll talk you through them all, but we'll demonstrate one. Gemma's number six. So I'll give you time. We've launched the kit, but I'll give you time to text me in. Have we got the text messaging service, please, Tommy? Yeah, send in your message to James Studio. 6077, I was also asking as well, what have you been inspired to make with our DVDs? Love to hear from you today. Love to read out your texts and find out who's watching. But choose, choose your strands, choose your design that you'd like us to demonstrate. From the Frosty Stone Jewelry Kit, don't forget, it's under 20 pounds. Under 20 pounds. 
A late show review, redo. Let's go for it. What am I picking up? Got it. All over it. Got it. My mahogany obsidian, which I would mix with those turquoises. You remember that six strand box earlier? The turquoises, or the blues even, of my lovely um, Appetite Jasper. They're a bit darker, but beautiful. I like those blues out of that Howa light, that dyed Howa light and Onyx box Chinese Jade we did, the first Speedy box we did. But as well as those two, those lovely chocolate browns, and wouldn't they look beautiful with that early bird? Do you remember the mink pearls and what have you? The caramel pearls, the shell pearl, the three? Yeah, do you remember those with the mahog mahogany obsidian? Wouldn't they look gorgeous? We'll get those on the screen. That was my early bird. Three strand pack of the pearl, potato pearl and the shell, $7.95. But this is not just mahogany obsidian. Mm. Botswana agate in the perfect rounds. So we can actually introduce this into the pumpkin seed kit. That would look nice with the frosty white quartz in the frosty stone kit we just launched. I'm very tempted. You know my little fee package to put in my red adventurine with those beautiful chocolate and then pick up the Wonder Stone that um, Lucy's working with today as a third entity. Mm. $14.95 originally for these three beauties. You know I'd love it just for the Botswana, wouldn't I? But I'm loving these shapes, the pear, the puffy squares, chocolate mahidian, uh, mahidian? mahogany obsidian, chocolate obsidian. So you get that black and white snowflake pattern. Well, not, it's not black and white, it's black, black and chocolate, isn't it? Milky chocolate. And then the beauty of Botswana in those perfect, perfect faceted rounds. It's a late show review redo. $14.95 originally. Actually, you know what will go beautiful? My midday madness. $9.95, under £10. Let me show you that, you know, my midday madness, my turquoise and my Amazonite. Let me show you that with these chocolate browns. Oh, loving that. Let me show you that with my Amazonite in that three strand pack at midday. Oh, beautiful with those chocolates. So you can really um, enliven them. You can really brighten them because they obviously are so dark and chocolatey, but add the minty freshness of turquoise or Amazonite. And it's beautiful, isn't it? That's my three strand pack at uh, 12. Beautiful together with the Botswana, but I'm just thinking about lifting those rich, dark colors further. What would you put with these, Luce? The psychedelic on. kit, Can't yeah, it was, actually it was cool, a six-strand beady box and it yeah. had in the dyed Howa light, which was yeah. the chocolates and the blues, the blues and the and browns, yeah. white Chinese jade and black onyx, definitely. The one that Jack light, the 70s psychedelic one. And this is under £10 and we've got Botswana in there, so I'm as happy as, I'm as giddy as it can be. So pretty and even just like um, uh, the, a little six, you know, a little six millimetre black agate just on the top of each of those for a little pair of earrings, you know, out of the frosty stone kit. That would be beautiful as well. You know those ones that you've got on your, uh, your stretchy? Just one of those at the top of each beautiful pear drop. Very pretty indeed, very rich. Under £10. I'd like the Botswana with the dog tooth. Let me just do that very quickly. The Botswana with that dog tooth because the silver greys in there and what have you. I think there's only about, there's less than 10 of those left. Righty-o, new today. Which one is it, honey? The Appetite Jasper, the second of my Appetite Jaspers. Please don't miss out because the large, I think there were six millimetres, flew out. These are my puffy ovals. And again, we got that incredible, look like a chiller or, you see that at home? Again, yeah. Amazing, isn't it? You just find it on the gemstones. It's just like little flecks of, of lightning. Appetite coloured jasper. I am starting with low stock because there's a lot of people taking advantage. They're beautiful. Really beautiful. My beautiful ovals of the appetite coloured jasper. 
It's like a kyanite colour as well, actually. It's like a kyanite colour. Beautiful. You can't quite see it there that I can see. I can see these little flecks. And I can see them here in the studio like I did earlier, but I'm not quite getting it on camera for you there. But anyway, that's what your 30-day money-back guarantee is all about. So you can have a little look. Get a little bit there, but oh, no, I'm getting loads on this one. But again, I, I get it to the camera. Can you see it at home? Yeah? You see that at home? That's what I'm talking about, yeah. I've been trying to get it on the camera for you so you can just see. It's like a little shiller. And it's in these gems. It's beautiful and... Uh, it's quite unusual in a jasper. I've just not seen that before. It's gorgeous. Low in stock now. Seven ninety-five. The large rounds were all allocated in the live show. So sorry if you're watching on the repeats, but good luck right now if you're watching. Uh, Seven ninety-five because it's a two hundred and eighty carats. Slightly smaller carrot weight, but uh, again, it's a different cut as you can see. It's a wonderful shiller in the Appetite Colour Jasper. Really beautiful. I, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm f well, you see, it's not a feldspar, and this is what you see in field stones. They're called feldspar, feldspar gems. They get their name from the German feldspat, and they are your moonstones, your sunstones, your labradorite, and that's when you see labradorescence, androrescence, adventurescence. Jaspers are a different structure. They're not a field stone. And this is why I'm amazed with this, this Schiller-like um, surface luster that I'm getting in there. These tiny inclusions in your Jasper, it's quite amazing. 280 carats, 7.95. Good luck, everybody. They're going like hotcakes. My blue appetite colored Jasper. Now, I'm waiting to hear from you about what techniques you want to see in the Frosty Stone kit. Number one is the bracelet, the chunky bracelet. Text me in. Number two is that lovely black bracelet. Number three, the earrings. Number four, the other earrings. Number five, the large chunky necklace. And number six, the drop pendant necklace there as well. So you choose Texas in, we'll go the majority vote. And so far, it seems to be the one that uh, our girl wears all the time, Gemma. But it's not for me to choose. If you want something else, let us know. And uh, don't forget my midday madness is this beautiful, pure Amazonite with a turquoise strand in there as well. We've taken eight pounds off what was gonna be the launch price. Can I show you these as well? Because they're gorgeous. I don't know if this is a late show review or what, but um, I love these with my Hypish theme. It's a three strand pack of silver shell pearl. Oh, okay, so perhaps I shouldn't show them. We may not have any in stock though. Let me show you my Hypish theme while we're... This is beautiful, isn't it? Usually you get it in a dark bronze, but... Um... You've got this beautiful, it's off the island of Paul on the coast of Labrador. Uh, so it's not far from, you know, the, the Labradorite quality. You get this gorgeous shiller on there. Beautiful. Hypersteam. Gorgeous. Love your chatoyancy. Um, Rightio. Say to me again, darling. Last chance bead boxes. Last chance bead boxes. Okay. So uh, these have been price slashed. If they're the last in stock, it's a great way of increasing your store with Jewelry Maker. And uh, this one has Jasper and Adventurine in all sorts of colors. So I'm gonna start with my Jasper Nuggets. That's a 90 centimeter strand in that really terracotta red brick. And uh, these range from five to 13 millimeters, 370 carats. I then got my green adventurine puffy hearts, eight by eight millimeters, 100 carats. And again, very subtle hearts like the ones um, Lucy's working with today in her challenge. I then got my yellow adventurine puffy coins. They are 12 millimeters, 175 carats. I've got my long chip, 350 carats of red jasper. 
I've got my red jasper rounds, eight millimeter, 175 carats, and my tubes, orange adventuring tubes, 13 by four millimeters, 70 carats. So lots of color. And again, for the six strand red jasper green and orange adventuring bead box, and some lovely colours in there, very sort of nature-inspired colours, isn't there, with the green and the terracotta red sort of soil colours and the orange and yellow. 1995 originally, 1495 today. Bead boxes are such a cost-effective way of increasing, you know, the gems that you've got. Maybe you're getting the daughter involved, your dad, your sister. Again, we expect, we wholeheartedly expect these offers not to be repeated simply because of the limited stock we're starting with. It really is Last Chance Saloon. Last Chance Saloon. Under £15. So, earlier on I mentioned, because in our Hub magazine it's got the fact that shows you with the polymer clay how to make the Queen's Jubilee flag. And when I was with Debbie there a couple of weeks ago, we, uh, we were looking at the polymer clay. And you can do workshops with us on it. Um, but I love our next Chosen by You. Not only because Lucy's done it, but it's been inspired by the party that we're all going to have in June. Or I hope you're having a, even if you're not going to the street party, I hope you have a little mini party at home. The Queen's Jubilee. I remember the 70s Jubilee. Were you, were, you, were you even around then, Lucy? Not for that one. <laughs> um, I, we all got a coin. We had a, a coin. We had, uh, I've still got it to this day with a head on it, obviously. Uh, this, was it the 77? Oh, was it earlier than that? That's terrible, I can't remember now. Uh, somebody tell me when the Queen's Jubilee was that first one. Silver Jubilee, was it 77? Oh, quick, look on a search engine for me, Tommy. I'm sure, I'm sure it was it earlier. That's terrible, isn't it? Anyway, I'm saying I remember it, I can't remember the date. Uh, so uh, I'm around for the next one, please God. I am, by still here in June. Uh, so, uh, yeah, so we need to celebrate. We need to party. And uh, we've got a Jubilee expression coming up in our Chosen by You, uh, which is coming up next. Yes, it was 77. I'll tell you where I wasn't there. You weren't even there. That's how young she is. Oh, my word. So, uh, and I've still got the coin to this day. So, uh, we'll, we'll celebrate this Jubilee, though, together. Yes. I was there for the 25th and the 50th. Yes, heavens above. Um, right. This is incredible. Wow, you've been busy. I have been busy. Wow. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven amazing pieces of jewellery. And inspired by Barbara from Nottingham. And she says, hi, all you lovely people at Jewellery Maker. She says, when all the news is doom and gloom, I thought you'd like a bit of fun and to make some jewellery for the Queen Diamond Jubilee. I've chosen red, white and blue. Very patriotic. So let's get in the mood for parting. I wholeheartedly agree, Barbara. And I, I love your choices. And she's gone for some really, really pretty, pretty pieces. Um, and you also picked some shepherd hooks because you said you thought they were unusual. And I agree. So, um, yeah, you've made these incredible earrings here. And I, I like this because I've seen these before. And I'll be honest, I, I, I just thought cascading tassels. But other than that, I didn't know what direction to go because they you can see they're large. But the gemstones there are a bundle. So uh, we'll bring those silver earrings up on the bottom of the screen, 7 95 And I, I can see, have you just attached those with head pins with the gems there, darling? Yes, I've got um, two gems per hole in the in the ah. earring post and what I've done is actually just twist it around so it's facing forwards at Aha. the moment they, they're sideways yeah which you could do either way mm -hmm. on, in this particular pair I just twisted it slightly because it, it's silver it's easy to work now my strand pack is slightly different to yours honey than it says on the screen there because it says tiger's eye I haven't got any tiger's eye in here oh I have a light blue There's tiger's blue eye blue. 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 it is sorry <laughs> I thought I'm losing the plot I was, I was expecting Brown tiger's eye. Yeah, this is my bundle. Is it all of these strands, honey? The whole... Oh, my word. I know, but I just wondered if we had an extra one or anything. Two red agate, 
Two white quartz, a crackle. Oh, there just seems to be no end, doesn't there? Uh, blue tiger's eye. And blue, blue, blue agate there. Wow. Lapis, sorry. Blue lapis. Is the lapis in there as well? My heavens, what a bundle! <laughs> This is insane. Lapis lazuli, tiger's eye, crackle quartz, pure white quartz, red frosted agate, and polished red agate. What a bundle, delicious bundle. Um, my word, low in stock though. And this, this is every single. Did you have something else in there as well, honey? Magnesite. In your designs, yeah. We must have popped in a bit of magnesite there as well. I haven't got to that, but let's just concentrate on the bundle. It was different. Yeah. Originally, if you buy these strands individually, all six of them, it's coming in at £46.70. But we have bundled them together, yeah. You're saving nearly £12. £34.95. Now, I've got less than 15 stocks, so we've got 250 carats of the rice beads, 150 carats of the 8mm faceted rounds, um, the bicones that are absolutely flawless, 95 carats, they're 6 by 6 95 carats of the crackle quartz, 6 millimetre. The lapis rondelles, 450 carats, 12 by 8 millimetre. And the 90 carats of the blue tiger's eye, 6 millimetres. And there's a saving of £12 because we bundle them together. And when you see today the kind of offers we've had, I mean, that could get you another six strands, that £12, couldn't it? Very good. And uh, you've, you've made all of this gorgeous jewellery with the exception of um, some more magnesite and I can see some red coral in there as well. So it's beautiful. Another three strands, yeah. Yeah. Let's have a little look at the designs. There was some howlite we gave you and I think some... I think it's magnesite actually in howlite, yeah. So what, what can I see? I don't have that strand, so it'll, it will go to the lovely uh, Barbara, but sometimes we just don't have the stock by the time we show the kit. I've got this uh, beautiful flower connector pendant. It's used on the end one. This is used on that end design. Be to beautiful effect. They're actually connected at using the, the little bale as well. Ah, Because they have some bales. Yeah. So how were you inspired? I mean, obviously we had the Jubilee theme, but uh, talk me through your designs. Well, um, with the uh, rice beads here, mm -hmm. that automatically to me said it needs to have a cascade ah. kind of one. So that was this necklace here. So I did varying oh, drops yeah. that Very included those. Very striking, yeah. Very striking. Obviously that's a nice mixture. And then mm. I, I had um, this pendant. Pendant Murterite pendant. Yes, I haven't got that on the desk here, darling. Okay, um, so with I that, can... it was obviously going to be a feature. Yeah, we'll and, then the I just, and then I, um, I, I used a, a nice mixture of them just to do a simple stranding, and then used um, head pins to make little features. I in, like that in wiggle. The front yeah, as well. I love that feature at the front there. <laughs> we'll bring up the Demeterite pendant code. Um, original price five ninety five, four by three centimeters, and used with the pieces in the bundle by Lucy. And for 24 hours only, we're going to price slash that Demeterite pendant. And it's a 5.95 because it's the only pendant we've done today. Yes. Isn't it? Yeah. The only pendant <laughs> we've done today. Let's let's keep it fresh. Let's let's price slash it like it was. 3.95, and it's a perfect blue with your lapis, isn't it? It there? is. It and works yeah. really well. Yeah. And, your with, and with the blue tiger's eye. Yeah. It all works really nicely together. Gorgeous. So if I just take these from the front, because you've made a lovely feature there. It is faceted. It's a large oval pendant. We've taken it down from... F oh, thank you there. It suddenly appeared. <laughs> suddenly appeared, as if by magic. Here we go. Our denim blue there. So lovely harlequin faceting there. Drilled at the top. And I, I like your choice of just making... Oh, sorry. Just making that little... You've left one straight on a head pin. One like a little yeah. meandering river. And a little bit of wiggle there. So with just to uh, mix it up a bit. Yeah, two of the bicone quartzes in the bundle and the tiger's eye. Just dropping in the... Because it's such a dark blue, it just gives it a bit of zhuzh, doesn't it? It does. And then uh, to connect it, I've just used like a little loop oh, yes. of the white quartz. That's your bale. The... Yeah, a loop with a beading thread. And the tiger's eye. Because the, the little silver bales that I had weren't actually big enough for this big particular enough. So you made pendant, your own. So I made my own on that one. Which I think is pretty still, because it's tying in with what's dropping in front. Yeah. It's the only pendant I've done today. Um, 
I'll bring you my flower connectors because what we can't see is the back of your lovely right. designs. And these are my magnet rose connectors. These are your clasps and they are magnetised so they just close together instead of a bolt ring clasp. They're, they're a lovely finish, aren't they? They are. So we've got one on the necklace, we've got one on the bracelet here. And they're so strong, aren't they, Lucy? They are. They're, they can take quite a lot of weight. I mean, this this big, heavy necklace here... Well, with here, the demerter right on it, yeah. Is, ..is on one of those, so... Oh, I, can never, I can never open them, Lucy. <laughs> they're just so... Can you open one for me? This just, just, it's just so strong. Let me show you on the back of this necklace, because that is holding a lot of weight. I don't know how she did that. It's so strong. <laughs> Practice. <laughs> I know. It's just like... Either that, I'm just, like, super weak. <laughs> um, here you go. I can just show you the what they look like when they're separated. It's just, you can just see the strength. So it's just because you show you, it can hold a lot of weight, can't it? So can you see the little magnets on the back? And then it just clips in and just sits in place. And there's your connectors. Beautiful. It's nice if you've got short hair or if you've yeah. got your hair up, then... And bracelets naturally move yeah, around, so... Yeah, so you can see that little feature. And these beautiful pendant veils I've got here as well. I'll show you the code for these. Now, did you use these, darling? I yeah, quite... I've, used, I've used it on the, the little oh, flower yeah. one because it wouldn't fit on the... Oh, it's just not big enough for the demurterite, yeah. So these are your little pendant bales. So I don't know if you can see that on our design at the end there, Tommy. And again, they just they just open out. Let's just see if I can open out. Now, I like, they are like little leaves, aren't they? They just literally... If I just open it out, you see, the silver's malleable enough. You see that from a profile, if I get my fingers out of the way? So can you see how they've just got those little, looks like little pincers, and that's what goes through the bail of your gemstone or your connector that uh, Hannah's that you see. <laughs> Honestly. Um, and then the bail. The bail is nice and big for your chains at home as well. It's a good three millimetres across on those. And in the pack, they're like little leaves. They're very pretty. It's a, it's a lovely finish, isn't it? Yeah, it kind of went with the theme with the, the flower connector and then I used some of the, the coral that I had. Yeah. And it kind of acts like um, berries. Berries, so you've got flowers, yeah. leaves, berries all together. And you get five of those in the pack in the silver for 9 95 But the bundle is amazing with that £12 saving. Gorgeous designs. Um, Barbara, I hope you love them in Nottingham because they're all coming your way. I'm uh, inspired by your choice. I really like the earrings. I'm really glad to see those. Little cluster it's earrings. It's always like it when yeah. our, our uh, guests are, are given a bit of a challenge or, or, or you're using something that you're not sure or we don't see much of. Yeah. You know, like the... Yeah, like the pendant connectors and the, uh, the earrings there, so beautiful. Right, I'm a little bit overdue in terms of the timing. My magic, my midnight magic, my, not mid, midnight magic. <laughs> You're very overdue. Losing the plot. I'm very overdue in that case. Uh, my midday madness, uh, the Amazonite and the turquoise. Gotta give it away, gotta give it away. Uh, it's coming up after this short little introduction. Do you want to be a part of Jewelry Maker? Do you think your creativity can help to inspire others? Then why not get involved and send us your ideas? All you have to do is visit our website and select up to 10 components, then we'll get one of our guest designers to make up the jewellery from the products that you've selected. Send your suggestions to chosenbyyou at jewelrymaker.com and we'll do the rest. If your entry is chosen, we'll send the made-up jewellery to you. Please only send your suggestions in once, as due to the vast amount of entries we receive, it can take a while for your email to be viewed. Good luck! The name tourmaline comes from the Sri Lankan word tourmali, meaning mix, because this colourful gem was often confused with other gemstones. Sri Lanka was also responsible for tourmaline's first appearance in Europe when it was sold to the Dutch traders in the 1600s. Add to your collection with our Wirework DVD, which is full of hints, tips and step-by-step -step instructions for all levels. Join guest designer Laura Binding as she takes you through how to create the Tree of Life, the Herringbone Weave and many more. To get your hands on a copy, phone our call centre on 0800 644 655. Jewellery Maker, bringing out the designer in you. It's time for a bit of midday madness. Midday mayhem, midday magic, whatever you want to call it. 
It's time. We're a little bit past midday. At least it's not midnight, like I said earlier. We'll be way past midday. Here we've got our beautiful Amazonite and our turquoise. It's a three strand pack and we've actually taken a good eight pounds off what was going to be the introductory price. So let's have a closer look because you've got Amazonite in its purest form. Um, I mean, I personally love to see all those different colors, but you've got all of those pretty, pretty mint spearmint blues. So you've got the uniformity on the strand. The gem, the hope stone, the gem of uh, good fortune, prosperity. I mean, if you're into that side of your gems, um, but I hope you like it because it is so, 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 so pretty and precious. The gem for the loving couples, as it's known, the Hope Stone. Gem of expression as well. It's a, it's a gem for the jury makers amongst you, the creativity amongst you, the creative amongst you. Now, we've got it in the puffy ovals. We've also got it in the smaller rice bead shapes. Pretty with the aquamarine, pretty with the appetite jasper, very pretty with those mahogany obsidians we had earlier. You know, if you want to just give them that, that gentle glow. Do you remember Fee's giveaway with my orange aventurine? Fee's secret package there. You know, if you pop that in, there's just lovely pastel shades, pretty with rose quartz. Um, just, just it, I find Amazonite just goes with everything. It really does. Lovely with those frosty white quartzes in the, uh, what was that third new kit called again that we're going to do in a bit? Frosty bundle or something, wasn't it? Frosty, frosty. Frosty stone, there we go, simple enough. And then my turquoise, my six millimeter turquoise. And you can see the little manganese oxide rivers. Some are plain, some are more dendritic in their patternings. It's all part of the charm and the beauty of December's birthstone, the forget-me-not gemstone. The gem for safe horse riding. It's a bizarre one, isn't it? What if someone just sort of sat down and decided this gem, the folklore of this gem is going to be loose. If you ride a horse, you shall not fall off. How does that work? Well, I know. <laughs> no, it's just random, isn't it? Have to keep That's the, the horse calm. I have maybe. They, 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 well, I mean, you do think it's random, don't you? But all sorts of gems get associated with all sorts of bizarre mystical powers, don't they? But that one I find the most <laughs> bizarre. Maybe it was in warriors and fighting on horseback or something. I can't, can I just say, I can't promise that, that you won't fall off your horse. <laughs> I really don't think you should trust, you know, turquoise to help you not to do that, but um, still fascinating. All right, go like hotcakes, brand new today. We've taken eight pounds off the launch price. No word of a lie. No word of a lie. At 14 five pounds a strand. It was supposed to be, and this is the truth, 22 95 So, after much discussion between Karen and I, much naughtiness, a few chocolate biscuits later, a little bit of a caffeine rush, 14.95 was decided for you today. So, uh, great opportunity. Get Oh, look at that. We're almost straight away into limited. I just, I, I just know you love your Amazonite. We all love turquoise. I mean, I always think of that colour for the summer. It was really beautiful. Excuse me, azure blues. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. And that's what it is. 1495 lots of you there congratulations don't forget i'll be with you tomorrow so we can uh, really take advantage of this one pmp all weekend and the late show tonight with the lovely jenny as well five till nine more demonstrations to come with lucy more demonstrations tomorrow with not just linda but our guests as well so 1495 my brand new three strand pack with the turquoise and the Amazonite. Lots to be there. Even as I move on to uh, this other kit I'm gonna show you, please hold the line. We don't want you to think we're ignoring you. And that is a free phone number. Gorgeous, well done to you. AGP 067 for the code for those three. Rightio. Bojangle was one name for it. Romancing, this is the name I remember for it, Romancing the Stone. Oh, was it? Did they double name something? Because I just remember starting to think about 
Michael Douglas and what have you. Kathleen Turner. It doesn't matter. We'll go with whatever it's called now because what we need to know now is that it's got a fantastic price point. We have got amateurine nuggets, 300 carats, and we're going to Pow! Price slash it out of the ballpark. Uh, we've got 280 carats of the brown chocolate aventurine, 10 millimeter rounds, and 110 carats of the African, which is actually just your dyed jasper, your dyed green turquoise colored jasper there. They call it the African turquoise. Six by four millimeters in the rondelles. All your, do you know what would look nice with that? Do you remember the dog tooth amethyst that was once upon a time available earlier? Mmm. Pretty. That, that Amazonite that you just got, wouldn't that look nice with this kit because of that uh, Jasper? Yeah, beautiful. That you just had, that three-strand pack with the turquoise as well. Or the large Amazonite. Do you remember the large Amazonite that you got earlier? That was, that was a bargain with all the different colours in it. Yeah. So the three-strand pack that we just launched is at the bottom of the screen right now. And if you think that would look beautiful with this kit, which I hope you do because that's what I think, Look at those three. Mm, mm, mm. Really lifts it, doesn't it? Yeah, so uh, get both because we're going to price slash the kit. Uh, Bojangle, it's called today. Bojangle. Um, so, 300 carats, 280 carats, 110 carats. All of our silver as well. Whoo! We need a drink of gin to cope with this one. Mm hmm. Because you know what? Lucy, guess what? We're not staying in 1995, oh, no. my darling girl. No! <laughs> She's beaming from ear to ear. We're not staying there. Amateurine? I know. Look at me, just, just treating it casually. How dare I? How dare I? Only comes from one place in the world. It's like your Tanzanite. Beautiful Bolivia. Amateurine with the flecks of gold, or in this case, we've got more of a predominance of the purple. It's not a criticism, it's just an observation. They're all natural. What's that, darling? <laughs> and Tommy, little Bambi, on his travels, went to Bolivia. Says it's a beautiful country. I've never had the pleasure. So it's a beautiful country to visit. And then my beautiful turquoise coloured jasper. Now, we're at 19.95. Do you know what I think would look nice with this? Fee secret package. You know, with that orange adventurine and those green, yeah, I will. Those green agates. You know that giveaway, that never seen before price that we had earlier? And that uh, Marianne and Donna won because their text came in first, guessing what was in my secret. Marion, sorry, not Marianne. Marion from uh, Canby Island. I say that because I like these greens that tie in with the jaspers. And I like the orange. Don't know what you think. Do you think they tie in okay? Work together? Yeah. Beautiful. But right now, that's my three-strand pack that I, uh, my fee secret pass passage earlier. Package, not passage, what am I talking about? Fee secret passage. Sounds like something else that does. Uh, sounds like we're in some bizarre stately home and I'm saying, come behind the library door. Tap three times and it opens. Mm, secret passage. Right, <laughs> $14.95. I always wanted one of those doors. You know, with, you've got your, your library and it's an invisible, it's a secret door, isn't it? They've got them at Book Palace. Booking Palace behind a uh, large glass dressing table kind of a thing, or ornate table. It's not very secret anymore then. You've just told everybody. I am, <laughs> I <laughs> It is a great get started price. No secret here. $14.95. Pick up that phone and get involved because that is a free phone number. You get your free tutorial, your, your DVD with your first order. You can get started. We've got tonight's show with Jenny. We've got tomorrow to access that one PMP all weekend. And we're spending $14.95 on Mr. Bojangles himself, on these three beautiful strands. We've got all the silver. We've got the beading thread. We've got the elastic. Bolt ring clasps, head pins, crimp beads, silver, under 50 pounds. They're going quick, they're going quick, they're going quick. I know, look at that, that, that is sometimes, our kits are sometimes uh, 20 pounds more than that. You know, high-end kit, 34.95, I've seen it, and quite rightly so, when we've had some incredible rare gems in there, but I can't believe we've even, because we've sold our amateurine 
just an Amaturine strand for that price. So to get the Amaturine, the Aventurine and the Jasper in there, plus all the silver, plus the beading thread and the elastic, for 40, it's a great starter kit. Because if you're thinking, I don't want to outlay too much, I don't know you, jewellery maker, I want to see what the crack is, I want to see what it's about, I want to see the quality of the gems, I want to see if I even like the hobby. You know, you've got, you've lost barely anything and you wouldn't lose it because you've got your 30 day money back guarantee and you've got your DVD for free. You've got your Get Started booklet for free. You've got your Hub magazine, which comes out monthly. You have to purchase to get the Hub magazine, but you get a top tip in there every month as well. Yeah, and we can Twitter, we can tweet, we can Facebook, we can monthly, give you monthly emails as well to keep in touch with us here. Ready? Ready? Ooh, late show, review, redo. Uh, can I just quickly say which of the designs you want me to see me do? Not me do. Ha, oh, that'd be laugh, wouldn't it? Uh, Lucy. We have one, the chunky bracelet. Ooh. In our new kit, Frosty Stone. Do you want to see number one? Do you want to see number two? It's like Miss World, isn't it? Do you want to see number three? Do you want to see number four? Do you want to see number five? Oh, do you want to see number six? Six is winning so far. Seems to be whatever our gem is wearing. Right, late show review redo. Oh, was this on the late show review? Ooh, naughty, naughty. Hypersteen. 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 I love this with its beautiful, beautiful shiller. Um, if you're in the metaphysical side of your gems, it's, in, it's a gem of self-esteem and emotional expression. It's supposed to overcome shyness. Again, I can't pop, promise all of that. But it comes from the Greek meaning over strength because it's an allusion to the hardness within the minerals um, of the gemstone because you get this wonderful metallic luster in there. You get this wonderful uh, chatoyancy because it's an oxide of titanium, brukite. And exclusively comes off the island of Paul on the coast of Labrador. And it often occurs together with Labradorite, so hence you'll probably see some similarities there. And, you know, you've got to really be careful when you're cutting it because this is a natural gem that has flaws, and flaws are detrimental to the gemstone. But if you cut it correctly, we're good to go with some beautiful gem pieces. Look at the shiller! Shiller! Um, yeah, oh, you've got, it's a silicate chiefly of iron and uh, magnesium. And looks very similar to the sort of the look of, you know, the silvery luster of hematite or lava kite. But it's got this wonderful, it looks like a pearlescence. Can you see that shimmer? It's almost got, the, you sometimes get the reds in there as well because it, it can often look like a dark bronze with the copper red colours. So sometimes you get that little warmth of like a reddish shiller. I love it. I love its beauty. Now, Developed quality crystals for this, you know, to be cut into a gemstone are extremely rare. Extremely rare because it comes from your igneous rocks. The planet once upon a time was all 100% pure igneous. And then uh, the rocks, uh, the igneous rock then became sedimented or metamorphosized into other gemstones. So it was all one big molten mass and then we got our crust and all that lot. Um, oh. Beautiful. Are you ready? Originally, originally, $8.95. Oh, what a way to experience beautiful hypersteam. And we rarely have it on the show. That's why I thought it was a new strand today, but it's a, a, a late show review redo. Something that we're reviewing, something that they reduced, as I now call it, the review redo. $5.95, crazy. Think about Frosty Stone. Think about Asteroid, that fantastic kit first thing. And how beautiful this would look with the kit. In fact, let me just grab Frosty Stone next to me here. How gorgeous, because of the physical properties, it would look with a kit, which I'm going to show next. We've already shown it. You've been plumping for design number six to be shown. It goes perfectly. And for the sake of $5.95, the kit is $19.95, okay? At the bottom of your screen. For the sake of $5.95 for the Hypers theme, one PMP across the weekend. Mm, bada bing, bada boom, I'm liking it. Free phone number to dial. Gorgeous. Every opportunity to, you know, I mean, Lucy's remit is only to use what's in the kit, and she's made six beautiful pieces of jewellery. I mean, obviously, with another strand like the Hypers theme, it would have gone to maybe seven or eight. 
but again would have changed the look completely and it's just such a beautiful if you've never experienced the beauty firsthand get it home try it out have a little look 30 day money back guarantee if you're not satisfied you know we'll refund that 5.95 to you no quibbles radio um, we'll have a quick moment. Is it nice outside or is it still raining? Psst, mm, says Jack. Bit of rain. No, no rain, but it's a bit inclement, grey. It's grey. Goodness me. We don't want to go out. We need to stay in and make beautiful jewellery. There you are. Jack the weatherman there. Uh, so we're going to revisit and we're going to take all these designs over to uh, Lucy so she can talk us through them. And we're going to see design number six that you've chosen on Gemma uh, as a feature because we'd like to see what you want to see in terms of the design so right up we'll get ourselves set up we'll take this all over to Lucy and then we'll be showing you step by step how to actually create this beautiful design out of our frosty stone kit don't go anywhere There are lots of different types of bales. This particular one has a loop at the end. This is ideal to add an extra feature, such as a charm. All bales work in the same way. Start by opening the teeth. Place your chosen pendant in the teeth and push both sides of the bale together. And there you have your pendant with a bale. Feelings on Jewellery Maker. I think Jewellery Maker is great fun. You get to meet loads of people you never knew that were there, never knew they existed because there's a community on Facebook that you can speak to. There are people who, they have, there's little groups that you can join and everybody likes to make different things. They'll show you the pictures. If you've got advice or, or they've got advice, you can swap notes. Um, there are all kinds of people of all different ages. It's not just uh, geared at ladies. You've got some gentlemen joining now, and you can make jewelry with with your children. Um, it's a nice it's a nice community thing to do, and I and I like the togetherness. It feels like you've suddenly got a whole load of friends out there, and it's just it's just a nice warm feeling as well as being fun. It was our third new kit of the day and it was only 19.95 um, our most affordable kit and i'm sure one that you're going to love if you haven't already seen it because we're going to look at the designs together but here it is and this is the big key feature that amazing large white quartz frosted nuggets ranging from 16 by 24 millimeters to 23 by 28 millimeters and then you had and this is what makes um lucy's design so demure i think six well, 90 carats of the six millimeter plain rounds and the agate and then the black veined jasper uh, 30 carats there the four millimeter rounds obviously for new jewelry makers you get all the silver as well don't forget and I'll, it doesn't just go to the new jewelry makers it goes to the regulars as well it's all incorporated in the kit everything you need to get started and all you have to do is start by phoning that free phone number interesting enough the design that you've picked is using the monofilament in the kit because you get the beading thread and the elastic but we'll, uh, Han Luce, oh, what's the matter with me? Luce, it's just because I've just seen Hannah on TV. Uh, Lucy has literally used all of those threading materials in her design. So we can go to Lucy Direct and, and just see how they've been used. So uh, number six was the one. Yeah, it was the majority consensus in terms of wanting to see how the design was used. Lots of you asked for that. So uh, thank you for your texts. But so uh, before we go to that design, I did say that, you know, you've used the other materials in your designs. Talk me through them, honey. Okay, well, um, the simple black bracelet in the, in oh, the yeah, middle there. Oh, yeah, there you go. Stretchy elastic. Stretchy elastic. Very mm. simple. You just use the um, elastic, thread it on the beads, do a couple of overhand knots, and then um, trim off the excess, and then put a dab of glue or clear nail varnish to strengthen the knot. Yeah. Great way to start, if yeah. you've never tried. Are we making before? Yeah. Start with that and then move on. And you've used those um, black um, agates. One, two, three, four, 
five designs, so you'd be surprised how far that strand actually went, oh, actually. Yeah. There's a lot of gemstones on it, isn't there? Well, the, the fact that we've got the nice chunky frosted oh, ones. Yeah, I love it. See, I love wearing, I was wearing those two together. I love those two together. It, it's good because it, it makes it go further. So yeah. I've obviously only used it a few with those. Look at the glow on them. They're beautiful, Luce. They are stunning. I think this kit is one of those staple ones that yeah. anybody could have. Yeah. It's great to start with, mm. but if you're more advanced as well, then it's it's one of those things that is going to go with everything. So anything that you buy to go with it, it's just going to add to it's it. It's a plus. Yeah, absolutely, it's a plus. So it might be nice to add a strand of like some something really bright. Like maybe. the red coral you had in your Jubilee yeah. or... or Pink tiger's eye. Yeah, something like really yeah, jumps something with a bright pot. Like that. And this has got a lovely weave in it there. So get yeah. me through. They're kind of like flowers, but yeah. not quite. If you do a flower, usually you would go all the way round, but with this I've just done the sides. So in oh, effect yes. it's a double quadrant. Ah yes, I can see and it's met, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. And using the so larger bead like... in, in the middle. Yeah, that's what makes it look like a flower, isn't yeah. it? Beautiful effect. So it's using a, a simple technique that's used a lot in a slightly different way, and that's which is it's, it's what all of it's about, exactly, really. So you exactly. use the same things, but with different gems and different amounts that you put together, it gives a, a completely different look. And that is what the earrings are doing, isn't it, here? Yes. Because that's half the, it's half the, 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 yeah, the quadrant, but you meet, meet the two together and... Uh... And the, the way the wire comes together, just kind of it rounds itself. Yeah, there's it's a quite nice bit more to leave a bit purchase there. in the wire, isn't there? Yeah, so you don't need to like put the crimp really close to the bottom. No, give it some space. You can have a nice, it's a nice you effect. Can elongate that further if you wish you to. You could, yeah. So you've got your elastic, which is your stretchy. That's got a bit more um, purchase in it. And then, of course, your monofilament is even more fluid, which we'll come to. But very briefly, these earrings. So tell me, I asked the question: Did you just grab the silver head pin and wrap, or did you wrap and then slip it in? Right, well, the way I do it is I start off as if, as if I'm going to do um, the spiral, like a, a closed spiral. Yeah. Um, and then you kind of pull it apart oh, gently, you tease yeah. it, so yeah. that you've got this, a little cup almost to yeah. put that bead in, and then you wrap the excess around that. Ah. So it goes all the way around. I'm liking that. It looks, well, it looks so beautiful and delicate. It'd be great as charms on a, a bracelet or yeah. even just as a little extra feature on the back of a necklace, something like that. Gorgeous. And then the one we're going to look at, the one that everybody's talked about, is this. Now, because it's on the white background here, the black agates and the actual vein jaspers, they look like they're just suspended, don't they? They're just like they're just stopping in time. And then you just use one of those very pretty uh, quartzes. But let's just take that off because this is using the monofilament, isn't it? It is, and it's an illusion necklace. Yeah. Because it, it does make it look like there's beads just floating on their own. It's very strong, that monofilament. Much stronger than you give it credit, perhaps, sometimes, I think. Not you personally, I mean, just us in general. Yeah. Stronger than you think. I think some people worry that it won't be able to hold a lot, but it can. Because it's so fine, <laughs> yeah, but it can. But talking about weight of it, the whole point of doing this necklace was in case there's people out there who are worried about chunky, heavy jewellery, that perhaps that's not their thing, they prefer delicate, then you yeah. can just use one of the, um, the frosted ones as yeah. a pendant and then go very, very delicate. Very elegant, yeah. Okay, it's my very darling. light, isn't it? It's very yeah. light, deceptive, deceptively so, actually. Because yeah. you think, oh, is that big quartz going to be a big old lump around my neck? But it's not. It's not. It's really <laughs> not. And, you know, you've got some, yours become slightly gradual in the strand that you've got. Mine were a bit bigger over there. They're it's all different. Just, you, you get 610 carats, it's just that they're going to be all different freeform organic shapes. Yes. So this is the one you're going to show us, which, yep. uh, take it away, my darling. Yeah, beautiful. So I've picked out one of the frosted ones as my pendant, and we're just going to get that ready by putting it on a head pin, like so. And I'm going to just trim off a bit first here, and then just do a little loop that we can hook on later on. So just the same as earlier, just twisting around those pliers to make a loop at the top, like so. Mm -hmm. So we're going to leave that to one side for when we're ready for it later mm -hmm. and move on to the monofilament. Obviously you get loads of this as well, so don't worry about having yeah. too much. <laughs> it's better to have too much than too little. 
So to do this, we're using um, what we call a stopper technique. Mm -hmm. And all I've done is um, use the stopper technique on a first bead, put a second bead in between, and then do a third bead with the stopper technique as well. Yeah. Left a gap. Do you measure that gap, or do you just do it by eye? Just do it by eye, really. Yeah. You, you could, but it just adds to the homemade well, feel I'll, of it. I'll be, I'll be honest, <laughs> it just looks like... I think your eye must be a very discerning judge because it just looks perfectly proportioned, just that kind makes of, sense. Yeah, you, I mean, we you have our little slidey rule yeah. in the uh, the large toolkit yeah. anyway. If you want to, you know, keep it exact, but... Um, and you've got your beading tray there as well, but I think, naturally, rule of thumb, your eye just aesthetically yeah, can see it. Yeah, if you compare it to the one you've just done, yeah. then you can generally work it out, roughly. OK, so... so it looks like you're working with invisible thread there. Yes. It's quite hard to see, obviously, <laughs> we're against still. <laughs> A pale oh, background but here. But she is threading something. I am something holding something, gems, honestly. Yeah. She's making the emperor's new clothes here. <laughs> You'll see when it holds on there and it doesn't just drop. <laughs> okay, so we thread our first one on. Like so. Okay, so you see I've, got, I've taken it right up to the next bead there. Yeah. But what we want is that gap. Yeah. So all I've done is moved it along. Yeah. By eye, see roughly the same distance. Distance, yeah. Then I put my nail in there to stop it going anywhere, so mm -hmm. you keep that distance, that's the way I do it. And then you're going to pass your thread back through the same direction that it went through before, so that it holds it in place. Gotcha, so it's almost wrapping itself around it. Yeah. So, I can just do this. Hard to see it as it's uh, clear, but... We can, we can <laughs> see it on the camera, honey, because... Uh, yeah, yeah it's easier to see it on there, yeah. in fact, than by eye. <laughs> it is, it is. That's actually what I was looking at, rather than you. <laughs> that makes sense. OK, so once you put it tight, you'll That's see it. it's Stopped. not going anywhere. Okay. But it doesn't camouflage the prettiness of the gem, does it? It's, no, because yeah. it's pretty much invisible. Yeah. You have to look, and because there's that um, patterning on the, those beads as well, yes. you really can't see it very well. Okay, so next we thread on. Was it an agate? The agate, agate was it? Yeah. Agate, yeah. It's all right. We've talked about that many gems today. I wouldn't expect yeah. you to remember them all, darling. <laughs> so that one's literally just threading. You don't need to do anything with it. Just take it up to your previous um, smaller bead. Yes. Yeah, so he can just sit there. Yeah. And then we we take our third smaller one, and again take that right up to the last one. Now with this one, you just need to try and keep it tight together and do the same stopper technique. Mm. So we're taking the monofilament back through the same direction that it went through the first time so that it holds it in place. If you can see it. <laughs> <laughs> now what I'm interested in is how do you get it to sit so close to the last bit? Okay. You can, you can yeah. see that there's a gap being yeah, created there. Yeah. So what you need to do is just, whilst it's still all loose, make sure your bead's right up against your other one. Mm -hmm. Hold on to the little bundle of the three. Yeah. And then, and then pull, pull tight. Ah. I think we do tutorials anyway on the illusion necklaces, don't we? But this, that's a good, like quick a nice, tutorial. Nice yeah. and close like that. Oh, yeah, lovely. OK, so then when we get to... We, we do that several times along the side of, of yeah, your neck as line. Yeah, I can see, yeah. And when you get to the point where you want to do your pendant... Pin. Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. Yeah. Let's, let's just quickly do this again. So, um, do your, your first stopper technique on a small one. So if we pretend that we've just sort of reached the middle of the... Uh, however long you want the necklace. This is what you do, and you get your stopper technique. One. And it's basically when you get to the, the, the third bead, oh, whilst you're doing your stopper technique, you're actually going to pass the monofilament through the loop of the pendant that you've made. Ah, okay. okay. Let me just untangle here. And are we control of it. <laughs> that's okay, darling. And are we finishing off as we normally would with our crimp? Yeah, yeah, all the same 
for finishing off. Just tie a few knots to make sure it's it's safe. At the end of the crimp, yeah. And then put a dab of glue or clear nail polish yeah. on again. OK, so we've got to our third Sorry, one. Sorry, darling, I was just trying to show you that. There. Here. And we're about to do the stopper technique on it again. But before we actually close it off, we want to pass... Slip in our pendant, yeah. Pass the monofilament through the little loop we made on the pendant. Okay. And then we continue to pass it back through that first, back through the, the third bead, sorry, in the same direction as originally. And not forgetting to keep it tight. So we move it close to the, the second bead, hold on to all three and, that and pull it tight. And that's attached it. And held it in place. So then uh, for the centrepiece, I've just used um, another... Black agate. Another agate, and then and then, uh, and then done another agate. stopper technique yeah, so on the other side. That's that mirroring there, darling. Oh, yeah. Gives you a bit of symmetry. Yeah. So we just did this last one. That's OK, darling. And obviously, then you just repeat Repeat the series yeah, of the exactly. threes to go up the other side of your neck. Fine. Beautiful. Very effective, very elegant. So, so 19 95 for that gorgeous kit. We'll get um, Lucy's designs um, uploaded onto the website as well. Six gorgeous designs made out of this fantastic kit called Frosty Stone. Going very quickly, proved very, very popular especially as the most affordable kit of the day. And there is the finished, well, uh, in progress, work in progress there with uh, Lucy there, but that was the demonstration we were just showing you. There we go. Gorgeous. Thank you very much, Lucy. Uh, we're okay. going to catch up with you, so uh, sorry to uh, speedily move on, but we're going to catch up with you on today's challenge. Yep. Can I ask you to join me at the Wall of Fame and let's look at some of your designs this sure. week? All righty, wow, striking pendant on this one. This is number 52. It's Emma in Barnstable in Devon. She says, uh, this is a necklace made, ne necklace made from blue and cream mash and jade nuggets, sterling silver and Botswana agate pendant with a matching elasticated bracelet. Lovely summery colours, all made from jewellery maker gems. Love the show. That's Emma in Barnstable, Devon. We love, I love that agate, Botswana agate pendant. You're number 52 and yes, very summery. So I've got number 59, who is Carol, who says, Hi, my name is Carol. This is my third Wall of Fame photo I've sent in. This is from three strands of genuine freshwater pink pearls, six to seven millimetres. I've made for her friend. I hope she likes it. I love your show, and you're all so funny. Carol. I hope your friend is like that, because yeah. that is beautiful, Carol. More stuffed animals, please. Uh, keep calm, be happy, this one says, teddy bear. This is from Janet in Surrey. And she's using the Chinese bloodstone, which she purchased a few months ago. Pearls and a few copper beads. Wow. She says, I started practicing making beady beads, and then I made a small and a larger one. Then one afternoon, my friend and I were watching the repeat show when we had a power cut. So it turned into a teaching ses session, and she was able to thread up another small beady bead. Then the set just evolved, and she loved it. Now, she says, this happened just before her birthday a week ago, so I was able to give it to her as a birthday present made by me, but including a bead made by herself. Love to everyone. Have a great week. Janet from Surrey. Well, Janet, I love the fact that, you, you know, despite the power cut, you carried on and uh, you've got another friend involved. Number 53, gorgeous design. Love the teddy. OK, next up is 58. You've got a stunning piece here. Oh. It's Karen, wow, wow, wow. who wow. says, Hi, all gorgeous peeps. Mm. <laughs> this is a chunky... Chunky! <laughs> ...three-strand weave. Pink opal, bronzite pearls and those dark ebony wood flowing amazing beads. Finished with ribbon and copper wire findings made myself. All from JM, of course. Also, a simple yet elegant pair of earrings. Didn't want them to clash with the in-your-face statement necklace. Please, can I win? I need more money and need more stash. Oh, yes. <laughs> Big all... loves to all. That's Karen. Karen, that you're is number 58. It's 
fantastic, Carol. It's brilliant. Uh, fantastic pair of earrings here from Diana. Diana, you're number 54, using Jasper Pink Adventurine and Wood Fossil. It's the Wood Fossil Jasper, sorry, in Baroque Pearls. And uh, she says, please bring some more kyanite to the show, uh, but in a high-end pear drop or a brillette. Loads more labradorite, please. And rainbow moonstone. If you had all three in the same show, my eyes would pop out in excitement. Uh, thanks for making learning fun and to all the lovely talented presenters and designers. Diana, you have exquisite taste. I'd say more rainbow moonstone, more labradorite, more kyanite as well. We'll do our best. Good luck, you're number 54. Next up is 56, who I think is... Um Maybe got the wire work DVDs by oh, the looks of it. Yeah, wow. <laughs> uh, it's Diane in Bristol who says, Hi, JM. Here's my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. These are some lovely summery earrings made using Amazonite and lemon jade with JM silver plated jewelry wire. The colours really look beautiful together. Would love to see more in soft pastels. Love the show as always. That's Diane in Bristol. Oh, Diane. Really good wire work. Brilliant. There, Diane. Yeah, clearly you have been watching the wire work. <laughs> Um, and lots of you as well texted in to say you've, you've been making lots with the Rakrani DVD because, funny enough, it's so in fashion, isn't it? All yeah. the bracelets and what have you. So, um, yeah, great to hear that. And lovely wire work here. This is number 55. And this is from Aisha in Glossop. And it was a bangle. She says, it's been my nemesis. Shaping the wire was proving quite frustrating. It took me about three weeks to complete because I would only do 10 minutes at a time before I wanted to throw it across the room. Oh, my word. She says, I haven't said that. I quite like the finished product. I made it using it black and copper wire, turquoise puffy coins, and lapis from my stash. Hope you like it. Aisha in gloss. Well, Aisha, you know, all that hard work has really, really paid off. It is incredible. And let's hope the next time it's a bit simpler and easier now that you've done it once. Good work. Definitely uh, yeah, worth it, wasn't 55, it? <laughs> definitely, if the finished product is as good as that. Okay, next we have Andrina. Yeah, Andrina. Who says, hi to all at JM. This is my entry for the Wall of Fame. I made these this morning whilst watching JM and waiting wow. to see if the rain stopped. No. My friend likes... It never stopped. <laughs> <laughs> my friend likes similar necklace and cuff. I made so much that I made some more. Slightly different with other gemstones. I hope she'll like them. I'm sure she will. Mm. <laughs> All the items come from JM, but the silver plated copper wire I have difficulty in obtaining from JM in 100 meter reels. We must have mm. run Maybe out of that. Run point. Out. Yes, we'll look into that. Uh, the gems used are Hawkeye Agate, Ooh, nice. Onyx Pearls, Silver Beads, and Mystic Quartz Rounds. Keep up the excellent program that you all do. Andrina, Andrina, you wow, are number I can see why your friend like that. That is lovely, number 57. And Aisha, you were number 55. So good luck, everybody, on Wednesday's prize draw. We've got less than 15 minutes left on the live show. We've got to have a catch up with you and your challenge. Yep. I think I've still got some more beauty boxes to do, so don't go anywhere. There's still lots more to see. The Jury Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jury designer. And each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their Jury Maker account, and the runner up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jurymaker.com. Or you can post your photos to Wall of Fame, Coloured Rocks Limited, Unit 2D, Eagle Road, Moons Moat, Redditch, B989HF. Good luck! And happy jury making. You can now watch clips from Jewelry Maker on our YouTube channel. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. When you place your first order with us, you will receive a free booklet and DVD full of handy hints, tips, and tutorials to help you get started with your new Jewelry Maker hobby. Shop with us on Friday, Saturday and Sunday and you'll pay one delivery charge of just £4.95. Alrighty, last chance on the bead box now and uh, we've got Snowflake Obsidian, beautiful red agate. Oh, they're all beautiful. Plus your lovely beady box. So uh, this is a six strand bead box. You've got the carnelians in here. Let's take you through it. We've got the long chips here of the actual carnelian. Uh, 400 carats, nine by four, 24 by eight millimeters. I know, beautiful, precious carnelian. You've also got the carnelian, 80 carats, six millimeter rounds. So beautiful, just perfect rounds there. 
You've got 150 carats of the agate, black agate rondelles, which are always useful. You've got 95 carats of the snowflake obsidian puffy ovals. So that black and that white there. You've got 280 carats of the, like a double strand, if you don't mind me saying so, of the nuggets. I know, so it's almost like a seven strand box, this when you've got a nugget strand in there. And you've got our snowflake obsidian flat drops, 15 by 10 millimeters, 120 carats. Four, uh, sorry, six. Dare I say it's seven with that nuggety strand. Six amazing strands there. And lovely shapes, flat drops, long chips, rondelles, rounds, puffy ovals, and nugget chips. And I'm sure, you know, given all three kits today, pumpkin seed, asteroid, and frosty stone, these, this box could, could integrate with every single one of them. Because you've got the mystic quartz and the reds and the citrines in your pumpkin seed. You've got asteroid, which was your black and the white. And you've got frosty stone, which was your black and the white. So with that obsidian and the agate, I mean, it's, it's a win-win, isn't it? So a lovely staple. It's the last of my beady box. Late night review, redoubts. And given our beady box prices, it used to be as little as 19.95. Can you believe we're going to go lower than even the previous price of 14.95? Are you on that phone? ASAB, you could say we've saved the best to last. I know. It's insane. £2.15 a strand and your beady box for free. I don't think any strand today has hit quite as low a mark as that. £2.15 a strand. Going from limited to low. Limited to low. 12, yeah, that is a beady box. This six strand beady box with carnelian, agate and snowflake obsidian. Three beautiful gem types. And onyx, sorry. Yeah, onyx as well. Goodness me. Four beautiful gem types there for £12.95. And once we've sold out, we've sold out. So get the code written down, NGP031. You need to make sure you get this in your store because less than 50 now. If you know your friend's working and she'd, she'd nab this, she'd have this in a heartbeat. $12.95. You've got one of our kits today for $19.95 or $21.95 or $24.95 respectively. You're adding to that kit and that order, that, that one PMP all weekend, another six strands for $12.95. So as a new buyer, get the beady box and get one of our findings kits. Yeah, amazing. Less than 40 of those left. Good luck on the repeat. And then Fee's secret package. I'll do another one tomorrow. And Marion in Canvey Island, Donna from Kent, uh, won these because they guessed what was in. It could have been one strand. I didn't say. It could have been a few. But uh, I decided to give another one away because uh, Marion guess, guessed that it was a Jasper in there and Donna guessed that it was an Adventurine. So two going to both of those lovely ladies. But it was a bargain for the rest of you as well. We had it at a price that was never seen before. Not even on the late night review redo. 7.95 for all three there. So some absolute bargains that ties in nicely with carnelian. Those black gems in that six strand bead box are always going to be used. And then I thought that looked beautiful. If I just go and grab them, you, you stay with me there because there was a strand of the Wonderstone, which I think has been my, our absolute find of the day. And I actually mentioned it, but I didn't show it together because these are peach colors, look at that. You know the red adventurine in there? And I, we kept describing the Wonderstone, that Jasper, that Wonderstone Jasper. Can you see how pretty? Yeah, those, those oranges tie in of the red adventurine. Works perfectly, doesn't it? And then you've got those Jaspers in there anyway. This was part of um, Lucy's challenge, which we're going to catch up with in a moment. 12.95. 18 millimetres they were. In fact, let's go and see her. I'll take this with me. Uh, she was also given a three-strand boutique pack, which was taken from $14.95 originally to $9.95, and it comprised of the red coral tubes, the pyrite, and the jasper, as I called them, the Neapolitan hearts. And she was also given, with the Wonderstone as well, a nine-inch, the large links of the gold-plated silver chain, which was $19.95 as well.
the detailed gold-plated silver chain. So these were the extras as well as the Wonderstone, which you can see on your screen right now. Feta, F-E-T-A-63. Um, the boutique jewellery pack was reduced to 9.95 on the show. That's those three strands of the tubes and the pyrite. And then the only other thing to add, and it'll come on the bottom of the screen, was the chain. Now you did say you were going to break it up. Didn't you? I did indeed. And, and that's you. what I've done. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Gorgeous. Let me just pinch this so you can see you're the bracelet there, darling, because it's so pretty the way those little jaspers fall. Yeah. Okay. And funnily enough, that's how you said. You wanted to see them. Now this is uh, a pair of earrings, very simple. And uh, matching that bracelet, I love the way you've used those as charms, Lucy. Well, they just asked for it, really. <laughs> yeah, because they're so individual. Very said, cute. You know, you said yourself, they're so individual, aren't they? The look they of them. They are, yeah. Very pretty. And then, oh, chunky monkey. Look at this, just a simple stretchy. Those pyrites really work it. in between, don't yeah. they? Yeah. Isn't that fabulous? And you could just use the Wonderstone there. You could. Not, not have the pyrite in between. But I kind of like the pyrite. It's nice it. just to get a different size, give it some mm, variation That's what I there. like. That's what I like. Yeah. Obviously, everyone's different, so it's and, up to you. <laughs> <laughs> and then, wow, let's go to this necklace here while we're on the coral and the hearts, because it seems to take two different directions. Now, look how you've cut the chain here. And I love this. Look, you put the coral in the, in, in the chain. How have you attached that? Is that with a bit of wire? Uh, I used a head pin, oh, head um, pin. But, I, but I cut off obviously the end oh. and just made a loop on each end. Very different. Hooked it over just to make give it a bit of interest. So you could leave just the plain chain if you wanted to, but um, look at that so added pretty. Feature. So you've cut it into three there, and I, I know you've used it in other designs as well. And there's some little tassels on the bottom. Beautiful. As well. Love but this. I, I think the red and the gold obviously work absolutely amazing together. So Doesn't that, it? That was why I started with that necklace. You've actually cut the chain one, two, three, four, five times because they, these work so well, don't they? <laughs> you, 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 your pyrite, the one stones, beautiful yeah, little I, I didn't dangle. want to make it too heavy, so I, no. I split it up. <coughs> yes, we've got a little quadrant weave there. And they, they do just blend well together, all those colours. <coughs> <clears throat> Gorgeous. And then the earrings, you did say earrings. So yeah, that chain goes such a long way. It's deceptive, isn't it? One, I've two, got, three, four, five. I've got two links left. Two as links well. left, so Sorry. we could have another pair of earrings. Good game. <laughs> Beautiful. So you could just use it as one bracelet and you'd probably get an earring or two out of it. Yeah. Um, but doing it that way, it makes it seem like it's gone so much further because mm -hmm. it, it's in so many different pieces. Once you've cut it, I mean, is it what how do you just like to just sort of pincer it back together again. I mean, sorry, it's just, sir. It's just like a big jump ring. Yeah. So you've got your cut in it. Yeah. Like so. And I mean, because of the size, you can use your fingers or yeah. you use your pliers and you just close it back together. And then you could do, yeah, it just say, it goes just right back to, in. Just yeah. give a little. You just have to do it a few oh. times. And it, it I suppose for extra security, again. you could use a little double glue if you, you wanted to. Fantastic. It depends what it's on. If you're putting something heavy on it, then I'd say yes, put yeah. a dab of glue. Yeah. But if it's something that's quite light, then it's, it's going it's to stay gonna there anyway, so you should be fine. Gorgeous. Well, I want to say thank you to you, Lucy. Fantastic designs as always. We'll, we'll get these uploaded on the website. Um, I'll be with you tomorrow on the Sunday sofa with Linda and two gorgeous guests. We've got Jen on the evening show five till nine tonight. So I hope you'll tune in. Uh, we'll have another fee surprise package tomorrow. Um, more bargains to get. I want to say thank you, darling. When will we see you again? Uh, next weekend. Next weekend. I'll be back. Marvellous. <laughs> uh, have a great weekend. Let's hope the rain stops. Have a lovely evening and I'll see you tomorrow morning at 9am. Take care. Bye. Bye. You can watch Duramaker live every day from 9 till 1 on Sky 655, Virgin 756 or Freesat 807. Get creative with Jewelry Maker. You can now keep in touch by following Jewelry Maker on Twitter. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. The Jewelry Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewelry designer. And each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their Jewelry Maker account, and the runner up receives £50. If you want to enter,
to your design, just send a photo to studio at jurymaker.com. Or you can post your photos to Wall of Fame, Coloured Rocks Limited, Unit 2D, Eagle Road, Moons Moat, Redditch, B989HF. Good luck and happy jury making.